Space You Know What Do podcast on Riotcast.com. Is this where it starts? Is this where we start talking? I'm so lost without Bobby. It's You Know What Dude, but today's a dude without dudes. Hi, I'm Dan Soder, also known as Monster Voice, joined by the real ass dude, Puerto Rican Rattlesnake, the show, hashtag, hashtag the, show, you mean. the show, hashtag the artist. Uh, the yeah, the, of MMA radio. the most searched man by debt collectors, Louis J. <laughs> Gomez, Chris Scopo. Hey, buddy, what's up? How you doing? The lovely Lauren. Hello, I feel hello. is lovely Lauren. That would be like a good nickname. I've never right. been more attracted to Lauren than I am right now. Aww, Down, hello. Louis Heel. I want to, and I asked her, and this, Louis Heel. This is true. <laughs> I really meant this. I said, Lauren, can I eat your ass on the podcast today? Um. I walked into the question. I walked in the door, and the first thing I heard was, you wouldn't let a guy just eat your ass <laughs> <laughs> That's the first thing that well, I heard. Her answer was, oh, no, butt play. And then I was like, okay, hold on, you won't let a Pause guy. Pause that real quick. We still got to get Deepu is hey, here. Hey, everybody, what's going on? Running the cameras. And yeah. Bobby Kelly on the road. So this is the, uh, a Disciple of Dudes podcast. He's not here, so his cutout is in the seat. I like it. I don't feel comfortable sitting in that seat. I feel like there's trap levers is, is and too buttons. Much, too much power. I just feel like the anger in that seat. <laughs> <laughs> it just yeah. controls you where I'm like, uh, so. I just start speaking in tongues. It's not in a boss. Uh, yeah. Fuck you. Fuck. I just go, but where's my coffee? I feel like Dan's a little hot compared to everybody yeah, else. Right. I mean, yeah. I feel like I'm cute, you know, but also like, like approachable hot. I run my, I run my own podcast network, joke. so I can hear oh, you things do? like that. You know, uh, I, I hear oh, yeah. Are other, you peacocking for Lauren? <laughs> <laughs> You know, uh, funny business. I don't know how long you've been in the business. <laughs> <laughs> I started my own company, and really, I find myself traveling wherever I want, whenever have you I talked want. About, had your, have you talked about having your asshole eaten on this podcast before? Probably, yeah. Probably. I feel like we do focus on people wanting to fuck Lauren a Yeah, lot. this isn't yeah. like a political podcast. I'm sure that was like the third topic by the time <laughs> she was in the room. I think it was like first day topics. Yeah, that's like yeah. a first day interview question. That's probably true. Yeah. Probably um, like, Dave, I used to like to do it with a little bit of spit in my mouth. So yeah. it's, <laughs> he always has this very descriptive element yeah. of his butt eating. From I do, I do love eating a nice ass, Dan. Uh, all the way in? Tongue all the way in? Yeah, I mean, I'll go. I'll do you go lap over, over? I just do a nice lap over. Is it like a bend over eating? Do you go? Yeah, in? I, know, I like her going doggy style and then okay. going from fucking her to eating her ass. You like wait, rubbing, you, rubbing her clit and fingering her okay. at the same wait, time. You, that is, this got like, very sensual. Wait, wait, wait. You <laughs> Louis J. Gomez is very and then sensual. I make eye contact with her through her legs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She looks yeah. down in between her I, legs. That's where I would fuck up in and give gap. a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's me. I'm back here. You want me to do it in a macho man voice? <laughs> yeah, this pussy is very sweaty. Yeah. Yum, yum, yum. Look up. <laughs> She's just like, ah, that took me out. I'm like, hey, you're drying up. <laughs> Lauren, can you do any impressions? Do you have any talents? Uh, Whoa. Not really. Come no. on, Lewis, how do you? You know what? This is totally like that's '90s style trying to get pussy, where you yeah. just put girls down. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're yeah, like, yeah. are you just not a useless slut? <laughs> <laughs> just tell me how big of a slut you Can are. Can you do a macho man, Lauren? I want to hear. Don't uh, do a macho man because Dan's here. Why would oh, I do a macho man? I'll tell you why. Don't but fucking no. give me that attitude. First of all, he runs a podcast kiss. network. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. Kiss, kiss, <laughs> kiss. Uh, because Dan Soder is the authority on uh, Macho Man impressions. Here's the deal, and I don't like to say this. You do whatever voice you're comfortable doing. All right, I'll just do a girl from Jersey. That, oh, that's, yeah. Yeah. that's very good. Yeah. Yeah. So there you go. You've lost at your own game. We're supposed to have two other guests, but they're both highfalutin assholes. Disrespectful. Here's what happened. Bobby, uh, Scopo reached out and said Bobby asked if I could guest host the podcast. He asked me who I wanted. And I thought of three of the biggest personalities that I know. Mm-hmm. Obviously, uh, lead personality, real ass dude, Louis J. Gomez. Puerto Rican Rattlesnake himself. He was <laughs> first. He was first on the list. Number one on the list. Number two, uh, Ari Shafir. What are you playing? <laughs> I'm calling Tim Dillon. I'm just, <laughs> oh, you gave away the third person, you uh, asshole. Uh uh-uh, oh, I was here. Oh, there's Ari. Yeah. Yeah. There's Ari. Cool, yeah. confident, collected Ari Shafir. Hold on, Tim Dillon. Just like yeah, every girl. cowboy. Tim, Tim, you're on speakerphone right now on the YKWD podcast. We're all wondering. Ari Shafir just walked in. Ari Shafir has two hour-long right. specials working on his third right now. Oh, he's, he's on his own... second season of uh, this is ha- this. Yeah, third, third, third season. season. Well, I thought it was fourth. Oh wait, I thought you did two online. 
two online. So this will be fifth. This so this is, is fifth, fifth season, season of this, this is not happening. Own TV yeah. show. Uh, Dan Soder just did his hour special on Comedy Central. Oh, I was also bonfire. filming uh, Billions yesterday. He's probably billions telling about that. Billions on Star of a brand new romantic it's, comedy, which yeah, we're going to talk about yourself. on today's show. <laughs> so bad. Ah, <laughs> uh, we so want bad. it so bad. I mean, the 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 lists of credits go on and on. I won't even talk about my credits, Tim. But I mean, I can I? You can creator of Gas Digital who houses Tim Dillon's going to hell podcast. You can say that I'm his boss. You absolutely can say you're his boss. You do sign his checks. I don't couldn't say that. Yeah. <laughs> so, Tim, listen, we're, listen, we're just him. wondering how it is possible that Tim Dillon, who has a total of 2,600 Twitter followers, Louis <laughs> <laughs> J. by the numbers, who, who go just Who just did... Who just got his first TV credit in one comedy knockout? How you could possibly be this late to this high profile of a podcast? Because I I just had a meeting with Ralph Sutton. We're planning a coup. <laughs> <laughs> We're planning to assassinate you. If you must know, and we wanted to do it, and we wanted to get a plan. In place. I'm going to be there in a few minutes. You know, I got stuff going on. Tim, you if know, you walk in, in if you walk in with a fucking ice cream cone, I'm going to punch you in your tits. First of all, I may walk in with an ice cream cone so that you touch me. But <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, I love the touch of a human. I will be there in a few minutes. Please go back to whatever you Hang up on him now. He'll be here in two minutes. Tim will set up one of those uh, one of those scooters for the chairs so you can get up here. Yeah. <laughs> one of those what are those called? <laughs> Bullet know. trains? We were discussing before we went on air, like Tim Dillon's gay sex must smell god awful. Oh uh, yeah. I mean he yeah, he probably has that ass reek. I feel like it smell like after like uh, the Colosseum in Rome. We're like, is it blood? Is it fucking? Is yeah. it shit? It's all of the above. What happened? Yeah. Uh, Ari uh, Shafir- Bobby is calling right now. Bobby's calling. Uh oh. Why does Bobby keep alcohol right behind his seat? I don't know. <laughs> Hi, Bobby. Hello. What's up, Bobber? Hey, dude. What up, nigga? Okay. Hey, Bob. Oh, oh, come on. Lewis, you know, I, the, the promoter is a black guy. He's in the car with us right now. You see it. <laughs> okay, you are the one who's calling him the N-word. I was calling you my nigga because we're friends. <laughs> So that's weird. You're like a really bad version of uh, of a Lean on Me when he gives the speech at the end where he's like, get your mind. What is that? What was that <laughs> Edward James Almost movie where he changes all the kids? <laughs> the kids? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's South Central or whatever. Yeah, that's what, you're like a bad version of that teacher where you yeah. think you're going to have some logic that blows his mind. Bo- Bobby Lewis just said if it's a black promoter, you should get paid ahead of time. That is true. <laughs> Lewis did say that. I didn't say that, but it's very good advice. <laughs> <laughs> it really bugs me that Scopo booked an all-star show. Like this, this is probably the best show ever. With, yeah. and I'm not there. Oh uh, well, yeah. Well, the yeah. fucking the hurri- yeah the hurricane Tim Dillon hasn't walked in yet. So the Long oh, Island, geez. I call him the Long Island Sound. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? What is what is that honey pig doing? Pizza? <laughs> yeah. He can't decide between pizza and shawarma, so he's doing the, the trifecta. And you might think, doesn't that mean three? Yeah, he's going to figure out the third. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bobby, I love the grandma peaches, the best pizza. I, I know you do a, a, a bang bang. Have you ever done a machine gun? It's just where you never stop eating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <bad. laughs> I, I'm, I'm t- me, and, me and Stavros, one of us is going to die on the store. Oh. We have not. We have not gone to the gym once. We've been eating noodles. I mean, ever or? Yeah, Dude, we haven't gone to the gym. We're eating shitty all day long. Are you guys doing a food version of leaving Las Vegas? We're just chasing all the worst. We're just chasing all the worst meals to eat. <laughs> Well, it's fucking terrible, dude. It's yeah. really bad. Well, I want to let you know, Bobby, we uh, we left. We put your cutout in your seat to make the balance feel correct. <laughs> oh, good. Well, good. I wish I want to get back to that cutout. I yeah. have to add more cardboard to that fucking thing when I get back. Yeah, or a pillow I'm in the middle. I'm going to die out here. <laughs> Why do you keep saying that like you know it's going to happen? Are you, yeah, are are you, you on a death march? <laughs> yeah, this is also your decision. You know what you're doing. If you could step outside of yourself, what would you tell yourself to do, Bob? Oh, I love when he gets all Never dietitian. talk to Lewis again. Yeah. <laughs> Good help. one. Lewis is like Thank a you. motivational speaker that doesn't heed his own advice. <laughs> <laughs> you got to go out and grab it. What am I going to do? <laughs> Nap. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta grab it. You grab it. I'm too tired to grab it. Bobby, you gotta grab that diet by the pussy and stick to it. Whoa! That's a whole food in Cleveland. Wow. Whoa. Grab it right by the pussy lip. 
Okay. Listen. We're Probably just fell asleep. Hey, Bobby, Bobby, man, you gotta wake the fuck up, man. <laughs> you see the black promoter? <laughs> Where the fuck, Bobby, sleeping, man? What the fuck, man? Oh shit, man, this motherfucker dead. <laughs> Not again. I can't deal with this again. Oh shit, man, this happened to Sugar Snacks last week. <laughs> Sugar Snacks is a great black comic name. Sugar Snacks with an X. Oh, yes. oh man, Capri Sun, dead, man. <laughs> I love <the> song. <laughs> That's his cousin. That's his successful cousin. Why, Bobby, why do you have Stavros? Stavros looks exactly like you. <laughs> Is that not confusing fuck, for the crowd? I, I fucked. Listen, I fucked up, Lewis. Okay. What do you mean? I fucked up. You should have brought me, right? I'm not bringing you. Are you crazy? Oh, yeah, one of you would have been no. dead. No, we, we literally can't be yeah. together for that long. I think a weekend is the, the absolute max, and we barely yeah. see each Lewis, other. Lewis, Lewis, you're, you're like Vegas. Three days. That's it. That's a yeah. very good. Yeah. That is a great. And what, what happens no, for, in for Lewis the, stays the, in Lewis. No, it doesn't. It goes on the Real Ass Podcast. <laughs> That's right, every time. And it's three days for the year, by the way, not, not all at once. <laughs> I was going to say for the whole decade. Yeah, yeah I was in Lewis uh, seven years ago. That was a rough one. <laughs> yeah. I the back Dude, shirts. I lost everything in I Lewis. Lost, I lost everything. <laughs> Went to Lewis for three days, and I uh, came back a different person. I don't know. I can't go back. I'll get arrested. <laughs> yeah, stop. Stavros really does. It, it really, he is it's like my little son. Open it for me. Buddy. Do people think he's this like your brother or something? No, I, I, I say give it up for my son every night. It's, it's like, uh, it's like Doink and Dink from the <laughs> WWF. That's a great reference like for any fucking wrestling fan out there that yeah. got shit yeah. in the. That's only because nobody could imagine Stavros as being Dink. It's uh, like Doink and Doink. I can't <laughs> imagine him getting through the ropes. <laughs> 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 ah, you guys are like Russian ah. egg dolls, except Stavros <laughs> gets stuck inside of you. He's like, Dad, get him out of me, Dad! Dad, get him out of me, Dad! Dad, Stavros, get out of me, Dad! <laughs> and, and Stavros is all like, oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I'm trying to get out of you, bro. <laughs> oh, fuck. I like to imagine Robert this... doing his stand up and Stavros behind him in those Instagram poses. Just, yeah. like, <laughs> just staying there. Like when they used to do school pictures of one face up in the left corner and then a, one in the right bottom yeah. corner. It's just kind of bizarre. Like the whole, I imagine. Yeah. Like, it really is like if you had Nick Novicki open up for you. I would love it. Let's do it. <laughs> Master Blaster style. You gotta, if you guys, uh, they probably don't know who Nick Novicki is, he, but he looks comic just. in LA. He he's is a, a midget and he looks just like. He's a little like, person. He, no, he's a midget. He hates that word. And so he looks just like oh, Dan Soder. God. He has the same face Lewis as Dan Soder. does not want a career at all. No. Listen to me. The midgets are in control of nothing. No. Ah, that's what you think. <laughs> Nick is like, my father was a midget. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am a little person. <laughs> and my son will be a king. <laughs> a little king. <laughs> yeah, fucking what's his name from Game of Thrones is, has opened up the entire midget market. Dinklage? Yeah. What Yo, market? No, for himself. What, no, what, what, yeah, what else is there? Yeah. He's... What the hell has anybody talked about how he has the word dink in his last name? <laughs> yeah. God. I never know. That's just perfect timing. <laughs> Uh, the doctor's like, uh, you've had a baby boy, and your last name is Dinkley. All oh, right, that's just funny. Have you seen his condition yet? Oh, uh, you're going to laugh when you see your son. He is tiny. So the name Dinklage, really, that's going to be hell in middle school. I heard he's not even really a little person. Just his parents put him in one of those boxes so his bones couldn't grow. Oh, well, like would be funnier with his name. Yeah, like a, yeah, you must be. Stay tiny. Like a female gymnast where they, don't, they stop him from getting their periods. <laughs> You will stay tiny right, we're, forever. We're going. Uh, we're going to get Thai food. Oh so. Jesus, Bobby! You can't say you're going to. You think you're going to die, and then tell us you're going to it basically a noodle restaurant. Yeah, that's all I, they have I is have carbs. To eat. You're going to pass by two Whole Foods on the way there. Just have a salad. Have some rumbling. Have it uncomfortable for a little bit, but then eat an apple with peanut butter. It's a fun little trick that I. Yeah, yeah but don't use Jiffy peanut butter. Use Shut up. All natural use, peanut butter. You can use Jiffy, like a real ass dude. Actually, for you, Bob. That right, so Potato salad is not a salad, by the way. <laughs> so, so Neither is saying, taco salad. Yeah. <laughs> taco salad is not a salad. Yeah, listen, Tim Dillon's going to walk in here in a second, and that's the ghost of Christmas future. And I don't want <laughs> that. Uh, and I'm talking to the ghost of Christmas present and past. Bobby, you've never sucked dick for a hoagie. <laughs> Do you know what gelato tastes like on a sailor's asshole? Delicious. <laughs> do you ever get halfway through an intervention and be like, this is just tearing our friendship apart. Let's just drink. Let's just drink. <laughs> Let's just do it. All right, listen, I'm out of here. I love you guys. I'm going to get a salad and then smoke a cigar, and then I'm going to have oh. Stavros 
suck my dick. Okay. Yeah. Which really, it's like you're blowing yourself, so it's yeah, not Yeah, that's not gay. even gay. I get it. You found right, the perfect companion. You I'll see you guys. All right, take Bye. a diabetic nap Bye, after Rob- lunch. Robert, uh, go to robertkellylive.com for all his upcoming dates. Is that right, Scopo? Yeah, that is correct. Right. See wow. what happens when you put in a year at Sirius? You start good. getting good at plugs. You're fucking good, Dan. Now that, now that Fez is gone, you can be the drop master over yeah. at Sirius. Yeah, coming up, Ari Shafir is going to be... Oh, I was trying to do a good Fez. <laughs> I don't think I have a good Fez. It just Fez sounded Molly. like you're a dinklage. It's, you know, listen, I got three speeds, buddy. They all yeah. fall under one of the three speeds. Yeah. Um, and we got away from butthole talking, so that was... Oh, we got, I want to go back to your technique. He was my talking about how he yeah. eats butt from behind. Yeah, I, uh, I bend her over. I'm fucking her from behind. Then usually my dick will get a little soft in the middle of it. Yeah. So then what Why? I Why? Because your brain wanders? Just because I'm fucking. Yeah, brain well, wanders I, is a weird thing. Brain wanders. I think women don't understand a lot about brain wanders yeah, where yeah. you're just like, he's. Look, I, I fuck a bunch. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't that special for me. But you yeah. always want to be like, that's <laughs> really what it is, dude. But <laughs> no, it's just, I don't. I, fuck. I'm over it. Like, um, I've been there a thousand times. It's not even for that. It's me. It's a menial task. I'll be like, should I drop off my laundry tonight or tomorrow morning? <laughs> that's, that's so rude and then the they, woman. And then they catch you like, oh, I mean. Ah. So then my but mind. But rarely. You're I too mean, hot for me. So my, yeah. dick, my dick will uh, start to. Uh, fill? Start to, to unfill. I call it the heroin nod. Where your dick starts yeah, to my dick starts a heroin nod. And then I'm like, oh, what I got to do? do something really perverted and fucked up. So let me lick the shit out of her ass. I don't think psychology That gets you hard. That, that gets me less hard. Yeah, yeah. No. So then what I do is I, I, I pull my dick out and then I start eating her ass. While I play with her clit, and then I finger her from behind while I'm licking her ass. But you, no, you said you look at her. You try to look at oh, her. Oh, no, I'll make eye contact Do you look through the gap? Her. Yeah, between her legs. In the gap, all right. Girls don't like the Karen's look, so though. Small, you can look I mean, we just heard a girl say that. I say yeah. hut one, hut two, hut three, hut. And you lift your right leg like you're in a shotgun? Down <laughs> set. Down <laughs> set. I'm a hot. I'm a hot. Blue 42. 72 is the mic. 72 is the mic. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, Brown 69. Hut one, hut two. <laughs> uh, audible. <laughs> girls, don't like the look. girls don't like the look if you look no, up when you're eating puss. No, you just want us to stare at the, the vagina. Just focus, man. Well, yeah. I, most guys, girls close their eyes so and look away. Yeah, but then sometimes you get the like weird, like no aggressive way. stare yeah. and it throws you off. The Mr. Wilson? Everything. Yeah. The I, do Wilson, like the looking, I do like looking up at a girl when her eyes are closed and like getting into it. Yeah. yeah. And then when yeah. she looks down at you, like, stop it. One at a time. But you know what's funny about that? It's like when you catch, when you're looking at a hot girl on the train and she looks at you and you're like, yeah. Like, oh, <laughs> oh, this is actually great. Hold on. Why don't we? Okay. Instead of looking at an ad over Hold our on. head. Guys, I got an idea. Let's, oh, let's build a fort. <laughs> Thanks for spitting all over the table. <laughs> I got so excited to do a fort energy. <laughs> I guarantee you, Lewis's idea is not going to be nearly Guys, as yours. I got a good idea. Let's, let's eat wine from behind. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. At the same no, time. no, no, no. Let's, no. Do, let's, let's, let's sure. tell. <laughs> I don't know how that would even work. All the, it would have to be a lot of dick in the butt. Centipede. Human centipede. Who would be at the very end of the human centipede? If it's bookended by Lauren and who? Nobody wants to be behind my ass. No, no, so that's not. Yeah. I'd be behind. I'd yeah, be yeah, you're right. <laughs> Ari, you're already go I mean, to the back. Yeah. <laughs> or his asshole starts sucking on my face. <laughs> <laughs> I look down, Lewis. I'm like, Lewis lost a lot of weight. Oh my god, everything's being sucked through his pee hole. Yeah. Yeah, everything's we... being, all of his organs are being sucked out of him. <laughs> oh, I'm losing so much weight. Why don't we describe people, we our pussy circle. eating technique? All five of us. Okay. okay. Actually, Tim can do, be last when he gets here. Finally, he's gonna be like this. I. Uh, I tell them to pull up their pants. Could be like forty year old virgin in the beginning, yeah. uh, and then I take my tongue thing and I put it into her the the, the hole I've that she said, has. I've said this before, but whenever I'm bored on the train and there's two very flaming gay guys like on the train, you I beat them up. I just go, hey. <laughs> I don't like it. No. <laughs> I always imagine them being like, oh, I just love pussy. <laughs> just them talking about pussy, and it always makes me laugh. Them being like, oh, dude, her pussy got so wet. Like, if you thought, if they were straight and you didn't know it. Yeah. It was like oh. a flowing river. Oh, my God. Just such hot puss. Well, we should have a competition to see who describes himself as having the best technique. Lauren, you got to take out of it who each person is, because I know I'm going to be in last place in that case. Well, don't okay. you think that in that case we should write it down? And I'll then... write it down. I no, 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 you don't. You don't Lauren is yeah, but you can tell. Dead, who, huh? <laughs> <laughs> She's retarded. Huh? I didn't ask you to be the stenographer. Uh, <laughs> I was saying just to keep some sure anonymity about it. Yeah, yeah, but with Lewis, all the R's are going to be backwards. Yeah. And he's, gonna, he's, he's like, gonna can I just draw a picture? Well. Can I draw a hieroglyphic <laughs> in different colored crayons? Yeah. <laughs> this means I lick hard. <laughs> this means I lick soft. H-U-R-T. It's a color thing. Uh, yeah. uh, and then when you come in my mouth, I go, cool. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, <laughs> dude, I have a bit right now on stage about Luis Gomez, and somebody in the Luis audience, uh, somebody in the audience goes, "Luis J. Gomez," and I go, "I refuse." <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. I, so wait, what's your idea? You want us to tell her our? Yeah, technique? we're gonna describe our technique to Lauren of how we eat pussy, and then she will pick which one sounds the most appealing. All right, go ahead. I mean, she's really into this. this is, but look, she <laughs> wants to get turned on right now. I'm ready. Let's go. Yeah. Look at her yeah. I'll go ahead, Lewis. Yeah. Why don't you start it off? I would have described my technique from behind. No, but do it. Do we have any central music? Can you get some central music going? Oh, Maybe Bobby's that. last album. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Put on some Bobby live. <laughs> yeah. You know, um, Lay on these silk sheets and watch me get it. Uh, why don't we do some Keith Sweat? Sure. By the way, this is uh, brought to you by Fantasy. Fantasy Football League Commission. It's time to restore oh, you the know position what? of commissioner. You're not supposed to do it. It's not supposed to be a mid-roll read. Oh, okay. Sorry. Do it, dude. Oh, damn it. I wanted to. You can do it now if you want. Oh, okay, cool. While he's finding music. Attention, Fantasy Football League commissioners. It's time to restore the position of commissioner to its former glory by giving the people what they want, a fresh start. With new leagues featuring DraftKings.com, you can play one, private, you can play one week private contest with your friends whenever you want. Wait, hold on. Serious question. Yeah. The football season is four, five games into the season. How are they going to start a league right now? Exactly. No more breaking up fights over free agents or smoothing over petty grudges. These are no. not answers to my question. Yeah, I know. But no more <laughs> listening to your league mates complain about their draft day busts or worrying that your number one running back has become a part of a running back by committee. I hate when that happens. Yep. And shake things up. Take the reins and start a new league. Oh. A league where you and your friends get to pick a new team each week. A league of our own, so to say? Yeah. Well, Lewis, it's not too late to save the season for you and your friends at DraftKings.com. There's no crying in podcasting. Exactly. <laughs> Don't wait. Hurry to DraftKings.com and save your season. <laughs> Set up your league today. Your friends will thank you. Enter promo code Kelly and play for free with your first deposit. That's Kelly to play for free at DraftKings.com. Eligibility restrictions may apply. See websites for details. That's how you read a motherfucking read. Central music. All right, Lewis, Scott. As Rick Rude used to say, hit the music. What's your technique, Lewis? Let's hear oh, it. Hold on, let me see. Is this the music that I would eat pussy to? What, what is, is this? this? <laughs> We're not in India, you <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> Go home. This is a classic tale of Vishnu. <laughs> <laughs> this is the music that we listen to down sometimes. This is page 72 of the... Uh, uh, of, in the Kama the Sutra, Kama it Sutra. tells you <laughs> to find yourself. We call this it, one the flying penguin. The, oh, well, let's just get oh, to this what quick. what a block. Okay, get go. Get to this quick. Look, because I want to hear... Well I, well, I would listen to Pantera. Maybe Cemetery Gates. What?! <laughs> That's, That's your we, pussy eating music? Yes. yes. You don't Pantera choose, Cemetery. Yes. On. Hold on. I choose my pussy eating music. All right. What this is you part pick? of it. This is part of it. It's got to be royalty free. I'm looking through royalty free. Shut the songs. fuck up. Oh, you are such Shut a Shut the nerd. fuck up. Nerd. Nerd. This, ain't, this ain't gas digital. We got to fucking play the by the rules. Shut the fuck up, nerd. Nerd. Nobody cares. What a I nerd. Care. That's, this is not what I would eat pussy to. What do you yeah, eat pussy I'm not to? Eating just, but you're not eating Keith pussy, sweat. so just let's hear it. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Boy. I like a little, uh, little tension. Bossing you around, Lewis. Yeah. I like that. made my dick hard. By <laughs> <way>. <laughs> well, I know it's going to soften it up here in about three, two, one. Tim Perfect. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> hey, Tim Dillon is in the house at Hello, Tim everybody. J. Dillon on one Twitter, correct? Exactly. Original call time. Nailed it. Tim, former child star. Half an hour late. Current megastar. I, I cannot lot, wait. I got a lot of irons in the fire. <laughs> 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 I cannot uh, wait until your fucking heat goes away. And you, I don't think I have any heat and now. And you're here 15 minutes early like everybody else. Lewis, stop no, your he, bitterness. He, 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 he means boner what we're about to do. Yeah. yeah. Let me catch you up real quick. Uh, Lewis had the uh, brain buster idea of all Genius. of us uh, describing how we would eat pussy to Lauren <laughs> and have her pick which one. Is the best technique. Okay, and you're going to be included. That sounds fair. In Great. Yeah. So Lewis is going to go first because his is his dumb idea. Okay. So we're trying to find some sensual music for him. And then Deepu came up with fucking. And then Deepu's like, <laughs> I can't do it because it's got to be royalty free. <laughs> so this is that's not how he talks, but in my brain, that's how he talks. Yeah, this ain't working. Yeah, what is this? What are you doing? Coming what? up on tales. <laughs> you know music, what, man? Pussy eating tales of you know what? I'm going to sacrifice her on a rock. Uh, this is some real fucking. Uh, I love you. Oh, let's go to commercial music yes. first. Hold on. Let's this is let it happen. Deepu. Yeah. yeah. This, this is, is an 80s song. This is an 80s song. Just get into it. Yeah, all right, fine. Play, play. Come on, get all into right, it. All right. So. <laughs> Come on. All right. First of all, I wouldn't kiss you on the mouth at all. All right. Cool. 
cool, cool, cool. That seems just classy. Rude. <laughs> I, I, I think that's a little too personal. We're just I'm just doing the work right now, okay? If right, you don't, right. I, I imagine they're going lip to lip, and he goes, if you don't mind, <laughs> <laughs> I'd, I'd like to wait. <laughs> and then he just starts unbuckling your pants. So, yeah, first of all, I'd, I'd, take, her clo- I'd take her shirt off, uh-huh. her blouse. Ooh. Her blouse. Yeah. Le- he learned some female lingo. <laughs> <laughs> she was just reading out of a JC Penny catalog taped to his foot. I would undo her bra and I would get it off very quickly because I'm a master at getting the bras off. I can do it with one hand. Okay. Oh, oh wow. Oh. <laughs> Please Jesus tell us Christ. more, yeah. Hugh Hefner. <laughs> How long did you not do it with one hand? Where you still think that's an amazing talent? <laughs> yeah. Keep with your seventh grade brags. I can do it with one hand. <laughs> you just did a snap. By the way, I've seen a girl's boobies. <laughs> <laughs> Got some Spanish guitar for Lewis. So, can you stop changing the music? My, I can't focus right now because <laughs> Louis. DJ Deep in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Louis keeps on turning the goddamn music. <laughs> Louis, it's me. It's your dead father. <laughs> Remember, the secret Gomez pussy-eating technique. Find yourself. Sounds like Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots. That's what I was going for. <laughs> That's nice. Antonio Antonio All right. I'm, I'm drying out over Whoa. here. Oh, she Whoa. lost it. She lost it. That's the game I play, though. I get them dry, then wet, dry, then wet. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long, a I can long actually play. only fuck dry vagina, so I have to keep, keep looking girls in the face. <laughs> <laughs> so. You have a, you have a glass of cold it. water next to the bed. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, hey, stop it. Yeah. I gently you press pour. into their eyeball. <laughs> Just not too much, but enough. Just points yeah. throughout ow, sex. Ow, ow, yeah, ow, we're good. We're good. Oh, They're back in. Uh, I so like then, traction. Then I start caressing your breasts. Okay. I start sucking on your nipples. A little bit of teeth. A little bit of... Not, not hard. Not hard. No, no, no. no. Very... <laughs> Show that you're there. Ooh. Just like... Yeah. Yeah. What's up? What's up? All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right there. You're n- now your nipples are crazy nauseous. hard. No, you're not getting nauseous. You're getting wet. Okay. That's what that feeling is. Maybe you don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> this is the problem. Lauren's a young girl. She doesn't know her own body yet. Right, right, right. Okay. I'm going to be 30, so. Yeah, that's, that <laughs> is not young. I'm pretty, sure she knows her, I'm pretty sure she knows her body. I don't know who you're fucking. <laughs> 68-year-old women at bingo halls. <laughs> like, it's his, it's his son's ass. friends. I know that, this spot. Daddy, yeah. can I bring yeah. Scott home to play? Mm, yeah. Bring Margaret. Bring yeah. her on home. <laughs> I want to eat her pussy. <laughs> so then I would unbuckle. Buckle your okay. pants, your jeans, Ooh. and you're Jersey trash. So you have like a three prong buckle. Right, 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 right. So, so yeah, like you like you're getting a swashbuckler <laughs> naked. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, were you just in a sword fight? <laughs> 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 so uh, this sucks. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> Lewis starts getting frustrated. No, one buckle won't go. What? It won't go. Jersey won't go. Can you slither out of these? <laughs> Jersey Trash only uses bell buckets like between their knuckles to fend off. Yeah. To fend yeah. off uh, yeah. They're like biker gangs. Yeah. They have to have a weapon on them at all times. Yeah. Uh, shit, one time I got sexually assaulted in Asbury Park. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I ain't never letting ha- that happen again. That's why I got this motorcycle <laughs> chain as my belt. I'll whip people. It's got a mace on one end. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All Jersey girls have apocalypse belts. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> So then I pull her pants down, <laughs> and they kind of get stuck because she's wearing Jersey trash tight pants. Right. So I finally okay. yank them off of her. Right. <laughs> like you're fucking, uh. You gotta pull it. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, straighten your foot out. Straighten your foot out. <laughs> One leg gets caught. Yeah. I leave her socks on, and they're, they're not matching socks. Never. I'll tell you this. No, Never. That you just made me hard. <laughs> 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 oh, I love a good socks on fuck. So then what I don't do. Can you turn the music back on, Deepu? Thank you. I, I don't kiss down her body. I think that's a hack move. Okay. Oh, that's uh, Amen. that's women and men are different. That. Yeah, no, no. That's women be shopping. I, I don't. I think that's a hack move. So you already did the tits. You're so not I'm, going the, back. I'm I'm playing with your tits right now, okay. okay? And I'm sucking on your one tit, playing with the other two with my other hand. Okay. Then I start to play with your clit with my finger. But my underwear's still on. No, your underwear are way off. I pull them down with your pants. Uh. They're <laughs> in, they're entangled in yeah. your jeans I mean, right to now. To do the two at one, I mean, to do one at a time, you almost have to pull the underwear away from the jeans. Yeah, Put them back I'd on. rather do that than, uh, I mean, I'm not putting her in Would a Would you rather do that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whenever Don't you pull the underwear back sentence. up, the girl's always like, what, what are you? Yeah, I what go are like you this, I go, that's your no-no spot. <laughs> <laughs> I, need, I, need I need full consent, for, consent the, for the yeah. underwear. I'll produce a contract later in the year. Now, the underwear come off in the jeans. Right. They're rolled within the jeans. Kay. I'm going to laugh at her trying to get her underwear right. out of her jeans later on. Yeah, yeah, as your dick just drips post to come on your thigh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. So now I'm sucking on your one nipple. I'm playing with your one nipple. I'm rubbing your clit in a circular type pattern. One finger inside, <laughs> rub back to the clit. Is it weird that right, is it weird that right <laughs> when you do that, I went like this? 
<laughs> <laughs> As you were doing that, I was like, oh, not too much. <laughs> <laughs> one finger inside, back okay. to the clit. Two fingers inside, back to the clit. One finger inside, like like a three fingers. Dance. She's three not fingers. Three fingers. Yeah. I'm not a fucking. I'm trying I to imagine Lewis is <laughs> moving his <laughs> shoulders. <laughs> Who does three fingers? Scopo just jams him in. <laughs> <Just> get it <laughs> in there. That's a queen's hole. I give it the JPP. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> this is uh, this is uh, we're real busy on oil changes. I got to get it done while we can. <laughs> Are you done? Did you come on my hand? Yeah. <laughs> so then. I fucking now I aggressively I grab your chin and I push it up toward ah, the pillow. Okay. Okay. That's how I get off. Yeah. 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 You also have so a big chin, so right, it's right, very right. easy That's to grab point. that fucking Jay Leno right. chin to just like snap your head. This is interesting. Anything that you heard about this? Apparently, apparently Lewis is my pussy. Yeah. I don't know if you've seen this. You heard about this? You're real ass dude. Uh, it takes the underwear off with the jeans. Uh, we gotta, you know. George Clooney's gonna be on later. <laughs> oh, and now the music kicks in. Right? So really get into it. <laughs> so then. Let's speed it up now, okay? Let's speed, speed up. Forever, by the so way. now <laughs> you have a face just mad. No, she's good there now. I got her there. She knows what's up. I'm Her on head's... my back. Yeah, you're on your back. All right. Okay. I open your knees. Spread, spread your legs. Grab your hand. My hands on your thighs. Okay. Maybe eight inches from your uh, groin area. Okay. Inside. Spread them open. Inside, pushing out. Okay. Or, or outside, How do you crap? And then I go straight to the clit. Right. To I'm the not. Clit. Fu I'm not fucking around with the lips. You're not going I'm down. Not, you're not stopping in labia. No more you're fingers not having either. a lick. We, oh, no hold more on. Fingers. Don't tell me what to do. No, okay. I don't you tell me what to do. Okay. <laughs> you like being fingered. Okay. Yeah. You just don't know you like being fingered. Okay, and then <laughs> that really... sounds like something that they would read you as a character <laughs> yeah. witness in a trial. Yeah. Yeah. Where you're like, uh, that's not the friend that I know. <laughs> uh, for the record, that's not the Louis J. Gomez that I know. But continue with your questioning, prosecutor. <laughs> yes, I was there. Uh, no, that doesn't sound like something. It's <laughs> a leading question, sir. Yeah, it's a leading question. I'd like to plead the fifth, if possible. Look at my defense. <laughs> Lev Ginsburg's like, we can get $7,000 more an episode. <laughs> oh, why did I bring my entertainment lawyer to a criminal trial? By the way, as we're talking about eating pussy, I'm looking at Tim Dillon's face, and it's like when I'm on Rogan's podcast and he starts talking about cars. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm I'm very interested. I li This is fun. I like You vape vagina, though. Yeah. You love eating. Was it good? Right? Yeah, I love eating. It was fine. I mean, it wasn't great. I mean, it's... When's the last time you ate vagina? Oh, man. <laughs> 2006. Six. Oh, oh George that's W. Bush administration. Yeah, we were, right about when the iPhone came. Right when the Guantanamo Bay story broke, and they had <laughs> pictures of all those people. You're like, I got to escape all this bad news. Yeah. Let me bury my face in some puss. Yeah, it wasn't bad. It wasn't horrible. All right. I mean, you I know. keep turning the music off. She Are we came. done? She came. She squirted all over nah, my face. She I faked it. No, she didn't. No, I always do. There's no faking it. Oh, you always, always do. You wait. Yeah. Did you uh, say you always? Every time. Every time you fake? Yeah. Have you ever gone through your life? Climax oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you don't... Sure. But you Majority do fake it. Majority of the time, I fake. Do you, when it actually is an it, orgasm, do you notify the person, like, hey, by the way, most of the time, I fake it, but this nah, one? Nah, nah. But why wouldn't you just not... Come? You're like why the Hulk. Yeah, You're always you say, angry. Why don't you say, hey, come fuck me, come fuck me. <laughs> You're like, do you fake it? I don't always, like, always fake, fake, but if I'm like, you know, I don't feel like waiting. If some guy I'll mashes fake. your face into a pillow by your chin... I gotta get out of life. Oh, you know what really makes me come is being called Jay Leno. As a man has his face in my head. No, I like, to, I like to bring her down a peg. You take her confidence away from her. So that was your whole technique? Because that sounds... What? Pretty lackluster. What? I went to the clip. It wasn't thrilling. I fucking kept on licking her clip until she came. With you, I definitely faked it, so... Nice. When, when do you turn her around? You see you turn her yeah, around. Yeah, thank you, Scott. Well, well yeah. I, look, I'm not... It's even... like there was like a scene in the trailer that wasn't in the movie. <clears throat> mm hmm Because he said it before, and he was like... No, but oh. that's how I would eat her ass, and I told you, that's to get my dick back hard. Dick back hard. Oh, and then you're ready to fuck again. Yeah, then I'm ready to fuck again after I eat her ass. Yeah. What about eating out from behind? Yeah, it's the best. Yeah. So you get the nose right in the ass? Yeah. 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 Then you go like this. <laughs> Plus Ari's nose hooks all the way yeah. down into <laughs> her stomach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He calls that the facial DP. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to get face DP? <laughs> <laughs> I'm leaving. Fuck you guys. <laughs> It's better than Lewis's long way to get fucking... He ran a marathon to get a mile, is that what they say? I, I don't, don't know. know I don't know. It wasn't going anywhere else. What was I supposed to say? I like her clip. What did you think she was going to be? Like an herbal essence commercial? She was going to start Do you want me to come right now? I do. No, I kind of want you to. Yeah. It, sounded, it sounded great. Thanks, Tim. Sounds Tim, great. what's your technique? How do you do it? Lauren, I would punch you in the face. Thank <laughs> you. Uh, and as you came to, I would be rummaging through your drawers. You would, 
You would almost think you were getting robbed uh, because you were. Uh, I would be, uh, you would wake up, I'd be wearing your jewelry. Uh, it would be strange. But you, you would put come. his lipstick on in the mirror. <laughs> yeah. goes, and then he'd just go like this over the mirror. He'd go, go back to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> you so can you take care of yourself so tonight. You're answer. dreaming right now. Yeah, you, this is a bad dream. Go back to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> That sounds better. Yeah. You're a dirty whore. <laughs> Scopo, I want to know your what's your technique. Ooh, uh, you've done it twice. Oh, this is I've totally ver- this is forty year old virgin all over. Uh, I, I usually I'll kiss for a while. Okay. Kiss the neck. Yeah. Got to get Then you go down. Uh, I imagine it's like when they show young kids fucking. Like yeah. when they're like, <laughs> like in kids where they were hooking up. I like then I like I like to get the rhythm of the girl. You figure it out how she likes it. You go eat the whole vagina. You don't just eat the clit, no. Just go to the clit, dude. No. Go to the clit. You, you know how much time you, you know how much time you waste on hole. that fucking <laughs> hole. I like the hole. Yeah. No, I girls. like getting in there. <laughs> <laughs> like a cat's sandwich. You know, like <laughs> that's together. exactly what I pictured. Just <laughs> trying to get. Yeah. Like when he puts chips on a sandwich. Yeah. That's where Scopo's dad took him to teach him how to eat yeah. pussy. Yeah. <laughs> Son. Pussy's like a sandwich. <laughs> You're going to get more beef. than you can handle. <laughs> and now it's also like an egg cream. Hey, hey bring me an egg cream also. <laughs> <laughs> now it's an egg cream. Now it's just right. Yeah. Just keeps moving with the like meal. Pie also. <laughs> also, I'm going to go get a cup of coffee. Yeah, pussy's like coffee. <laughs> Stay away. Might burn you. <laughs> Scopo's <laughs> dad get the analogy for anything is pussy. <laughs> anything he wants to eat. <laughs> I don't know, son. This uh, this car ride home's like pussy. Deepu, what's your technique? Wait, I, is he done? I feel like that's it. You just eat the whole vagina. I mean, that, that sounded oh, I, like I mean, a cop like, out. I, nom, 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 I don't nom. know. I go down there, eat the whole there. pussy. It happens. <laughs> you put a little yeah, relish on it. Uh, <laughs> Uh, you hope the Mets are good. <laughs> <laughs> he eats a pussy. <laughs> what about? Uh, uh, actually, her, notice how the music all of a sudden comes back up in Depot. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad you could ask me, Dan. Um, I actually read this tutorial recently on how to eat pussy, and I, that fucking. Yeah, shit you're my done. Life. Nope, yeah. you're done. That's right. Cut him That's off. Enough, right? He just referenced a Maxim magazine article. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a it was a Reddit thread actually. That the is the nerdiest way to eat word. pussy. <laughs> yeah. That People is that have nerdiest... never eaten pussy ever, you're getting advice from. Well, the circumference of every average female's gi- vagina. What was it? It was. Uh, was it a subthread <laughs> called Lick Puss? Uh, yeah, it was under R Lick Puss. Uh, it was just. A, it was very detailed about like how to go very slowly, you know, and uh, you know, start kissing nope. neck area, nope. face area. Wrong. Face area, just <laughs> kissing your <laughs> <the car. laughs> yeah. uh, Kiss forehead. Are you blessing me? Yeah. <laughs> hey, don't worry, you I'll make it all the way down there. Oh, I will make yeah. you very wet. <laughs> I'm going to get you on every angle. I kiss your fingertips. You're joking, but literally everywhere but I kiss you everywhere 1, but nipples and pussy. Times. What? Kiss him everywhere but nipples no, and pussy. No, that that whole fucking slow play shit is bullshit. I don't think okay? so. Okay, we this is not fucking 1975 I think romantic found, novel. Uh, uh, Girls want to fuck. Yeah. Oh. Thank you, Lauren. Okay, Not Lauren, which side are you? Which, you, you I'm on the fuck side. Exactly. Whoa. Are you on? Do you want Deepu yeah, fucking you a, you kissing it with your him. body one thousand times? No, I will yeah, say. I will tell you, yeah, some people don't want to get eaten out. Some dudes like a blowjob is good for like seven seconds. Like, all right, let's fuck already. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Some right. girls I'm like I'd rather like, fuck. Yeah, there's some it's guys that like thirty minutes. Yeah, it's an app. Yes, it's an app. It'll open up the flower. But I feel like he's trying to do a tapas place where he's like a fun little thing. So we're just I bring all. All the sensuality out for the table to share. You want your dipping sauces? <laughs> <laughs> what you want to do is just take bites, little yeah. bites. I soak my fingers in lavender water. <laughs> just take it. And then, and then we bring a palate cleanser. Meanwhile, Lewis are. is like, you eat in the car, after the driveway, once I give you the burger, eat it. There are many types of naan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the best. This is garlic naan. <laughs> but we're not describing sex. We're describing eating pussy. Right. Yeah. yeah. But I work my way down there, and then you know I kind of I kiss the labia majora. A little I bit. I make eye contact with the labia and say I will be here for quite <laughs> a while. <laughs> And uh, so I kiss the labia majora, kind of, you know, get that to open up a little bit. Call the labia majora. Yeah, labia majora. Not cool. Do you tell her that? Not cool, but helpful. I'm kissing your labia majora. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) What do you feel now? Like a doctor test? He does it so medicinally. (laughs) Like his father? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) He stole his father's test. Tell me when you feel pressure. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Oh, that was.
was the trigger. You just get zapped. Yeah. Bobby's like, someone's trying to sit in my chair, dude. <laughs> So, are uh, you kiss the labia majora? And then, uh, you know, so eventually the pussy kind of opens up a little bit, gets a little more. Uh, no, it does not. No, it does not. I've never heard of this before. Fly trap and just opens up. I don't think you've ever seen a vagina, dude. It's like a magic. No, <laughs> it opens up. It opens up. It's like, like the face of the villain in, in, in Stranger Things. <laughs> Dude, the Demogorgon. <laughs> Demogorgon pussy. I feel, like, I feel like Deep was reading the Reddit thread and watching Stranger Things. I got to mix it up. That's good. 11, right, that's good. 11. Yeah, and then you're... I eat it upside down. Uh, yeah. Oh, my God, Sorry. dude. Oh. Dude, it doesn't it open up. It up. No, it doesn't. It okay. does open up a little bit. Hold on. No, no, no. When you, it's ready, it comes out. No, it does not Very open up. Any guy who thinks girls have tight pussies, is, is Pete your hands to this, it's because you haven't gotten it ready yet. Yeah. No, no, here's the thing. It does get swollen and wet. It doesn't open up. That's what, what I'm saying, though. Swollen, and then the... Swole, can we take swollen <laughs> out of it? No, it's swell. Not. Swole. It's swell. It gets swole. It gets swell. That sounds like 1950s. <laughs> How, how's your pussy? It's doing swell. <laughs> Get on in there. Yeah, it gets swollen. Yeah, yeah. 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 When I do it, does right. yeah. I beat it up with a fucking metal pipe? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so wait, go, you're going through your <laughs> soft <laughs> like Streets of Rage. <laughs> you throw up. a knife at her. <laughs> yeah. Deepu's doing a. Uh, d yeah. Okay. Keep going. I want to hear what else advice this Reddit thread taught you. Okay. So besides the fact that vaginas open up. <laughs> <laughs> at this point in the activity, it will open. It will open up. It will say, "Hello, I'm ready." Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Jam your tongue in me. My mom pops in and gives me the go ahead. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay, so I kind of work the left side. You know, I don't go to the clit. I kind of take. <laughs> he's doing it like it's a, he's doing crowd work. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, I work the left uh, side, you know, the right side. I kind of see where people are from. Yeah. I ask if there's any birthdays in the vagina. Yeah. Uh, I also you know, I work the back of the it's room. Like a check a spot. Bit. You gotta go each yeah. side of the room. I tell the pussy to give it up for the wait staff. <laughs> Works out some, some horrible jokes. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do some quick jokes. You guys might see these on the next roast. <laughs> And uh, so, <laughs> I think that the, the place to start is the area between the uh, the the entrance, the, the the vagina hole, right? Yes. You went and from labia majora to entrance. <laughs> the entrance. Yeah, you can't go specific to vague. What's He's the like, term I have for not it? read chapter four yet. I'm not there. <laughs> that is the actual vagina. Okay, that is the vagina. That's good to know. Okay, so uh, I lick the area above the vagina, below the clit. What? A above the j vagina. <laughs> Uh, the hole, below the clit. So the uh, it's almost like the it's almost like the taint, but it's the opposite. Yeah, the runway. But there's not. Is there's no there's air. Not. What, can we name it's that? It's clit then pussy. Can we name yeah. that the depo? The depo. <laughs> no, this is look my depo. The deep <laughs> Are you looking my depo? Like, I mean, this is such a small spot on you. <laughs> yeah, I have to, that's a very specific spot to get. Yeah, why? Why there? Is that what they told you? That's what they told me. That's how sometimes you find the clit. You run down that runway. Yeah. And you're like, wait, yeah. where? And you're like, oh, let me get the. Hold on, Lauren. Does any of this sound appealing to you? Um. To be honest, <laughs> I stopped listening about five minutes ago. No, when no, Lewis I get what he's Smith. saying. I, I when mean. I talked about hitting you, was that more? <laughs> yeah, that was fucking <laughs> fun. That's, That's how I like it, Tim. Was that, that more speed? Or that is. Was it a head into the headboard kind of deal? Or more like a headbutt. Yeah. Wham! She's going to get a Scottish boyfriend. <laughs> Lauren, I'm here to do two things to you. Headbutt you and eat your ass. Your Did arse. you just work a Scottish accent in? It had nothing to do with the reference. It's a headbutt. I know, but what so Scottish it? people headbutt. That's how they fight, because they're not allowed to have knives around. Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. You don't have knives, they're thing? pussies, you, uh, so they have to. Whoa. Have to All right, Deepu, so I think we can yeah. say you're at the bottom of the list, <laughs> unless Lauren's going to an OBGYN, <laughs> and then Scopo's just vague. I'd like to say Deepu as that creepy uh, OBGYN. Where do you go? <laughs> oh, you, you, it's weird. You're Why were you searching hole? Uh, Reddit to how to eat pussy? How'd you end up on that thread? Because, I, you know, I've eaten Opie and Anthony subreddit. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Um, no, I was. Uh, I, I noticed I wasn't great at, eati at eating pussy. I needed some tips. That's great, man. Yeah. yeah I had a girlfriend once who didn't. Who didn't? She wasn't into blowjobs. She didn't know how to do it. Uh -huh, and then I was yeah. like, ah, oh, whatever. You know, fine. I, I'll deal with it. And then suddenly, like, uh, like three weeks later, she just started going for it. I was like, she goes, I did some research. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Such a turn what on. a take. What yeah. A, I mean, that what a good girl. Yeah. What that a great woman. Yeah. Yeah. It does sound so much like less pathetic when she did it. Oh, so much less. Yeah. When you do it, you're like, what a. Fucking yeah. nerd. But you do it, you're like, get a life, Deepu. How are you not married to her? <laughs> yeah, wow. She went and learned a skill. Yeah, I mean, I, I haven't had a girl that didn't up. know how to give head since I was like a teenager. Girls, when we were teenagers, none of them knew how to give head. Out of my entire adult life, I've dated two women who didn't do it. And you're just kind of like... Didn't do it at all. Just they, One, uh, both, it was a couple times. Yeah, like a, uh, they got to do it. Yeah. They got to do it. I had it. a girl who didn't swallow recently, and that was... 
weird. You got it. It was like, you got to, I haven't had to go like that to do that for a while. Did she have a spittoon next to the bed? She did. She spit in my trash. Oh, it was like she came in her mouth and then she Ew. spit it out. Yeah. It's unsettling when they do that. It's yeah. like, that's rude. I mean, well, also, wait, here's my thing is when they make like a face like they're like eating garbage. Right. You're like, all right, come on. Just pretend <laughs> that you enjoy it a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> that was weird for me. I was like, you don't swallow Yeah. You. Oh, my God. I'm offended that you think my essence is that gross. Like, well, yeah. Like, no, like seriously. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, like, when, like when a kid, like what when a kid eats, eats, like uh, when a kid eats cottage cheese. Yeah. Like, oh, oh, oh. Wait, bring up, bring up, bring up videos of babies tasting lemons. <laughs> <laughs> Where they're like, <laughs> yeah, so do you what... like the taste of cum? Eh, it's no. fine. Uh, do you? Ha, are, have you Wait, ever just, spit? Just like yeah, yeah, yeah. Gay dudes don't even swallow. It doesn't go near your mouth. Can I ask you a question? Really? A you're lot just of like, times, yeah. It's oh, AIDS, really? AIDS, AIDS, dude. Uh, you bitch can't get AIDS. AIDS. No. Your stomach acids kill it. The well, Lewis sounds like a, a sex ed teacher in a Queens <laughs> high school who's like, you can't get AIDS in your stomach, especially if you drink <laughs> orange juice. There's a, a lot of acid in there. <laughs> There's no such thing as stomach AIDS. Yeah, he's like, a gym teacher from uh, 86 before the disease you, had a name. Here's the deal. <laughs> uh, like, unless you're listen, a, it's only in yeah. bathhouses. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're not going to catch it unless yeah. you get a hug from a gay man. You can't. Dudes don't do that unless right, you're in right a relationship. Here. Really, right right here. really? Guys don't <laughs> do <great>. oh, <laughs> Especially for you, the baby's loving. <laughs> but it really is like a girl that hates. <laughs> when a girl hates your cum. <laughs> it's a baby. Right here, watch. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's so oh fucked my up. God. When you imagine it with that mind, it makes it so much fun. When you have a child, do you like look at this? You're like, how, how do people torture their kids like you're this? that aspect? But think about if you put that face on a grown woman. Yeah, why are they feeding the baby? This is it's right here. Well, yeah. Just imagine there's a girl you're on a date with. You're like, I'm going to lose it. And then she's an adult woman. And then this face. <laughs> <laughs> but he likes it. I'm imagining cum in this baby's mouth, and it's making me <laughs> oh, so Now you take the baby out of it. Tim, are there different tastes in cum of different ethnicities? Oh, oh excellent, excellent question. question. Thank you. I don't know. I don't know if it's ethnicity. Oh, you're a Republican. You only fuck white dudes. Yeah. <laughs> I, no, no, no. I don't think it's ethnicity. I think it's a lot about the person, like what they eat and right. stuff like that. I don't think it's. Eth I don't think it's like ethnic. I don't think it's like. I don't think it's along ethnic lines. Before I'm about to get a blowjob, I only eat asparagus and pineapple. Let it have a battle royal in my <laughs> stomach. Oh, right. 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 A real, a real sweet and savory. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like, like a people, payday. People that eat a lot of payday. fruit and, and are healthier, it's definitely different. It's better. It tastes it better. It would be better. Yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. Yeah. Yeah. Is it salty? Yeah. Yeah, oh yeah. You've never tasted your own salty. Cum. Lauren, Lauren. It is. Can you stay out of this conversation? <laughs> it's salty. <laughs> We're talking about cum. Hey, I'm an expert here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, so it's salty? It's salty. Yeah. Like very salty? Not over. Food wise, salty. on par with what? Salted caramel. Okay. No. <laughs> it's delicious. Like, know you answer. rushed to get that one out. Salted salt yeah. caramel. That's kind of the best thing I've ever had. Sea salt. Yeah. yeah. Would you say it's salted caramel? I'd say it's like salted sweet, like it's salty salty and caramel. Sweet. Yeah, yeah. It's salty and, salty and sweet. And so it's sweet. delicious. So yeah. how are women not swallowing? Because well, sometimes I kind of want to jerk off so in my own mouth. Yeah. Sometimes it shoots to the back of you, don't you? Like, Th then it's easy to swallow. Right. It's but down then there. sometimes your cum is like real <laughs> thick. Look at that baby. Yeah. Oh, I hate it. Is that your cum? Oh. I don't like Hold on. I'm gonna put it back in my mouth. Let me let me try <laughs> it again just it. to make yeah, sure. Hold on. Those kids. I oh, I'm like eating it. the peel. Can't stop eating it. I'm such a bad boy. <laughs> so wait, wait, you said sometimes it's chunky. Sometimes it's like dudes too have chunky thick. cum. I used to when I was younger. I'd yeah. Oh, cum. really? Oh yeah. Yeah. Rich and chunky. Sometimes it's really white and sometimes it's clear. Sometimes yeah, yeah, yeah. I have like, like clear with white. Tim, how much of a whore are you? I'm not a whore. Do you fuck around a lot? I fuck around a decent amount, not a whore. I assume you're you're probably in the. 35th percentile for gays. I don't know what that means. Where you don't fuck. I don't, I don't fuck nearly as much as the people that are around yeah. this like you don't fuck like it, You don't oh, fuck as much that. as the average, but yeah. you fuck some yeah. more than a straight guy, but like. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I, it's, I, don't, I don't know what people are doing. I think that there's a lot of people uh, that, like the, there's dudes here that fuck, and I'm serious, multiple times Mark a night. Mark Norman levels. Every night, yeah. multiple times. Yeah, yeah because dude, dudes well, are just yeah, fucking that's horny. Those guys are 99th percentile. But that's their life. That's all they do. Like, there are some gay That's why they stay in such good shape. They're good shape. And... They go out and they drink. They get fucked up and they fuck. And that's all they do. And that's it. What is your theory on gay guys and, and good shape? No offense. But, like, what is your theory? Oh, on... I mean, you know, because it, 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 you're, their whole, the whole thing was about sex, 100%. Yeah. yeah. So you weren't allowed. Like, when you, I think when you were, uh, you, 
a while ago, let's say the 80s, even the 90s, even the 90s, even probably the early millennium, like everything other than sex, you couldn't even do. Like if you, if you walked around, if you tried to make emotional connections with people, you would still do those things. But there would be such a like a, you know, a, a societal like, you know, so, so I think it became about sex. Would it, any culture that's hyper sexualized is generally going to have people that are... They want to look better. They want to just look better. It's like so you're saying like Italian To compete, too. I'm trying to think of who else is like... Well, Europe. you want to compete Greek. for like, I need to stand out, so I need to... Yeah, pick, yeah, pick and I sure. think there's even... Do, like, there's... Uh, and, and then there's like became different types of gay guys. They became like bears, and they became right. otters. When did became, that start happening? Because for a while, the gay dudes were like shaved... Every, not only good shape, but like shaved, muscular. And then they were like, oh, then they were bears, and they were... Le like, if you go to a gay bar, you will see people that... It, it encompass every different body type right. but I think it's just that one body it's also the media is like this is the one gay dude we show you all the time so you all go oh yeah that's the one oh like, that's women, the like guy. women in Cosmo yeah I mean it's like oh oh yeah that's yeah. the guy yeah. oh, oh the, the black comedian's loud and talking about whatever like oh that's the you show people that one archetype for so long when did the variations come into play like when did like know. twinks and bears years, I think and... technology enabled all of it okay so yeah. there's now a way because technology there's a term for everything now yeah. there's like an app that's an can, interesting point yeah. Yeah. some people must have been closeted people... bears before where you're like I have to stay in shape but I'm really naturally I just want to be, be a... like bigger like Bobby. I, I inside I feel pizza. like a bear yeah. <laughs> they just kept saying yeah, I, don't know. Yeah. I wish there was a term for it I just feel like I think Such the, the gay dudes that were bears stayed in the closet. Oh, like I think, and I had like I think a lot of the, a lot of the a lot of the so maybe sad. more masculine gay dudes stayed in the closet because they could play it another way. And like then once, just, once technology came, there was other people that were like you, and you and felt more accepted, people, and you get into groups. And then so fetishes like, became a thing. Where but you're people, old enough where you grew up a majority, like, like, I, like I hooked 11 up years guy old without. Who just needed my fat and screamed the whole time. Like it was bread dough. He just needed it and screamed. Like, that ah! real, did that turn you on at all? No, it was weird, but that was it was. Is for that him. a real thing? That's a real that thing. That was your virginity. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I, I thought so it was gonna be like a, a lot different than that. that That's how we got weird. Montreal. That yeah. was, that was, that's how I've gotten everything. It's how I got the thing on gas. That was just um, his meeting right there. He's just laying on yeah. the floor. It's a businessman going. Ah! <laughs> so like human cookie dough. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's my grander name is human cookie dough. Uh, but yeah, so I think technology was a big thing, and like because you, like if you were a gay dude and everyone knew you were gay, you yeah. had to be gay you but you had to be like in shape that kind of gay you had to you would go out you would dance you would do drugs you, and you don't dance I, mean, I can I you do not, yeah I can that's the gayest thing about you <laughs> yeah no I mean it's like big J will dance like a fat guy dancing it's not like no not they like won't a, dance. I've never seen Jay well, like I don't dance. go like I don't dance Jay yeah, Jay's out, a great out dancer. danced you on Legion he's a great dancer he's much dance. better he's than you he's a good dancer yeah yeah, yeah. no but he's a better dancer than you that's the point that I'm making though he won't go if there's music on in a bar he won't go no, up no, to no, dance I'm not I'm not I would never seen Jay go like this hey hold my drink I feel like if Jay was drunk he might get in there be like yeah let's go I've never I've been in plenty of environments with him where he He'll leave a shirt on when he swims, but he'll fucking yeah. Bonner dance. Bonnaroo, he didn't dance he didn't when we were on Mushrooms at Kendrick Lamar because he was making fun of me for dancing. Oh, really? Because I was going nuts. And he didn't even yeah. get in the pit for Slayer. Now they think about it. I mean, it. yeah, he didn't but even you, do garbage uh, dance. Well, you did. You yeah, got in two did. pits. Oh, did you, you really garbage did? dancing? He wouldn't even do that. So maybe he doesn't dance. What's he garbage get, dancing? You know. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's great. <laughs> I, yeah. I, I, I'm if he wouldn't do that, then maybe you're right. Maybe he won't dance. I mean, I'm not gonna. I'm not the guy that goes out and goes to a dance club, probably. Yeah. You know, yeah. but that's also because I do like I do stand up a lot. So that my my main like, if I wasn't doing stand up, I would probably have more of like a social life where I was like, I'd have to do more. Yeah, I don't things. go out at all. I, I never. I don't go out. Like I don't. My go to night bars. out is a night in, like watching yeah. TV. Yeah. Yeah. Right, right. So when I 100 percent, I'd rather find somebody to hang out with at home. Yeah. yeah. Than go out anywhere. And do you bring dudes anywhere. home like that? I, I go to people's hall. I like, imagine all of your yeah. sex being Port Authority bathroom sex. No, not Port Authority bathroom sex. I'm glad that you think you think that's about this. literally what um, I imagine. Why do you imagine that? I don't know. He feels um, like you have to be embarrassed about what you're doing, so there's no way to do that <laughs> anywhere near any neighbors. Of yeah. it. With, well, it's all imagine. with Republican senators <laughs> in the Port Authority. Well, then I guess now, Tim, you're not going to say anything to my family. Like I, I'm yeah. going to put your <laughs> pecker in my mouth. <laughs> now, again, just, you I tapped just, on my foot twice, which means <laughs> I will be the one performing. I just research you. when, like, Christian groups are coming yeah. through town. Tim's when like, is your train coming in? Yeah, I'm like, 2.30. I'm like, Tim, can you feature for this week? weekend? He's like, I can't. There's a yeah. convention. Yeah. They're having one of those conversion yeah. therapies. Yeah. Wait, it's, it's a Mormon it's, it's, convention. It's, I'm going to play center field outside of the Javits <laughs> Center. Is Fleet Week a big time for fucking here? 
Do the sailors I, get off? Yeah, like, I mean, I think I think there's a, I think it's more for straight people, but I think there's a there's a gay thing too. Yeah, hundred yeah. yeah. percent. Yeah, I'm just uh, but as someone that kind of grew up without the internet. Cause yeah, what, were you like eleven when you got AOL? Older. Probably older than that. Yeah, older than that. Yeah. But I'm saying, like you said, Middle the technology. School, 13, but, the, but the technology like made other gay men who weren't in shape and that kind of like loud, like the stereotypical guys, gay men. Those dudes were always around. This is the thing. But this I'm saying, like, missing, was yeah. as being a young closeted gay man was that like as the internet came out, where you're like, oh, cool, I'm all right. There's other like like, did you feel like alone? And then like, oh, there's more people. No, like, I think I think uh, not oh, yeah. conforming to that stereotype. Of, of what a gay dude is. And so in the entertainment business, they want you to be that. Like yeah. They want very much you to be like, hey, yes, queen. Like, yeah, yeah. that's what they want. They want. Oh, if you change yeah. out of nowhere, <laughs> it just, but Tim that, shows up and he's like, girl. You're like, oh, God. But damn that, this. but I may have to, <laughs> you know, yeah. but that, that's what they want because that, that's what makes people feel comfortable. It makes people feel comfortable. If you find out, yeah, like, that's if, why there's if, no. If, when I, think, I say that I'm gay in a comedy show, there's dudes in the back that are like, maybe I'm gay. Like, what is this? Like, so, so there's a weird, there's a weirdness about sexuality. But I think it goes hand in hand on why there's no gay football players or why there's no because people They're aren't out. ready to accept that yet. People are not ready to accept that. A yet. straight seeming, or just yeah. A, yeah, just a man that isn't flamboyantly gay and who just likes to have sex yeah. with who is in love with men. Yeah, like, I, I like it. I like to know that my gay men are gay. That's you want your like. gay men gay? I want them gay. That's like the next level. of I like, want a woman to be a woman. I want a man to be a man. I want a queer to be a queer. I think kids growing up. I think <laughs> there's this weird spectrum of sexuality where like kids growing up now yeah. are very much not as fixed in those roles as so that's are. what I'm, that was basically a lot, my a lot question more fours someone, and twos. I think there's a lot more <laughs> I think a lot, a lot of more, threes coming out of that closet there's when they a lot more in college there. stories now than there were you know what I mean yeah. I, know, yeah, well, so I think there's also this. a thing yeah. now where like you know kids are coming out very very young you know other uh, I also you hear stories about like um, Bonnie was talking about it on your podcast yeah, the, yeah, I guess yeah. it was a transgendered little kid yeah yeah um, yeah there's one in Colorado who's they seven said, years old but it's like a nine year old but like all the kids are cool with this little kid and I think it's great you know what I'm saying it's just a different time because when I was a kid we would have uh, doused that child in gasoline and well, you were also raised in the woods. You, afford, you also raised by wolves. How would you afford the gasoline? <laughs> yeah, you were what also you raised in, in the... Don't waste the gasoline, Louis. Guys, uh, listen, we've only got one can of gas for the semester. Uh, I'm thinking this kid thinks yeah. it's a trans girl. kid. His mom yeah. sent him off to siphon it. That's how they made money to live. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Louis, did you, go do, did you go suck your sweet mama's money juice? Yeah. <laughs> But I remember, I think I remember we had a rumor of one kid in high school that was gay. He was obviously gay later, we found out. But, like, it yeah. was like, I heard, I think his name was Aton or something. Was like, I heard he was gay. It's like, no way. See, we had. Yeah, that was as close as we got. We had a lesbian principal, and, sh and there was a group at my school called GLAD, which was gay, lesbian, activist. Yeah, we had GLAD as well. Yeah, yeah GLAD, which is like a thing, which is very progressive for the 90s that they had that. Yeah, yeah, that's but, right. Oh, we had that too, but we, we had a, a good ladies against asshole dykes. <laughs> it was really the opposite. <laughs> It was really like, get these people out of here. <laughs> like, get out of here, you queer! Yeah. But I think the people Shave that are... your pits, dykes! Yeah, I think the, 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 pe the group that's being the hurt the most by this are frumpy women who need to be beard wives. Yeah. Because now there's no more beard wives. Oh, men right. are coming out. Yeah, they can't so get So there's not these sad without... women who are like, I knew he was gay. Fag there is something. There is fag something. Yeah. Called fag there is. My sister was a fag hag for a while because yeah. she was overweight and insecure. Yeah. So she would... She filled up on siphon gas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're not supposed to swallow it, <laughs> Open. Well, uh, no, yeah. she would uh, she would like fall in love with gay guys. Yeah. So then she wouldn't feel like rejected Reje because yeah. it's not, yeah. it has nothing to do with that's her. why a lot of gay guys go into the priesthood because they have these. If they're religious, when you're raised, you have these awful feelings. You're like, I'm evil for having these feelings. You can kind of oh, hide but it. let me go into this field where I'm not allowed to explore them. Mm -hmm. and yeah. That way, I'm not sinning. There's a lot of dudes that that, that, that do that, and uh, it's such a fucking nightmare. Yeah. Yeah. Psychologically, but, uh, it's just it's pure bad. destruction. It's bad that those people are on a pulpit giving advice to other people. Yeah. Like the Lord you know is going to judge you. <laughs> They're like, listen, it's so the way the world works, and it's like you're not even okay with your own thing. Yeah. Is that, even, the, that even the men that aren't gay, or even the priests that aren't gay, that yeah. are that just want to fuck That's women? Metzger, Metzger has a bit about is that the Mormons told him or whatever he has. Jehovah's told him yeah. like you're not supposed to masturbate. He goes, do you know what happened if you never masturbated? Do you know what happened to your body? He goes, no, no one does. It's never happened. Yeah. That's they were telling me to never masturbate, even though they definitely have. Yeah. What, uh, does I meet dudes where I know I feel like they're really gay all the time, and they have chicks, and I'm like, really? But there's a lot of, I mean, I think there's we a lot all of guys know guys like that New where York. you're like, are you gay? There's Harrison a lot of guys Greenbaum. in New York that are uh, it, it weirdly like, like, I've had dudes after comedy shows come up to me and go, hey, you want to hang out? And I said, okay, we exchange phone numbers, and then they'll, and it, which is weird, and then they text me about their girlfriend, and it's like, oh, these are just like 
beta males that want friends. You know what it is? And it's really? so fucking weird. Dude, I don't think so. I think yeah. they might be gay dudes. They might want you to take same, them out of it. But yeah, not even that, dude. I think out. it's the, the hunt. You know what? I'll do this all the time. I'll be on the road, and I'll be talking to a chick afterwards, yeah. and I'll get her number. It, dude, it happened with that fucking big black stripper. And then she says about boyfriend? And No, no, but she'll, she'll text me. Uh, that Let's she wants to her. fuck, and I kind of just oh, get that. I, I just get the the enough. validation that I that I'm wanting. We talked about it before on Legion of Skanks, but Lewis getting out of that girl wanting to fuck him yeah. was one of the funniest things I've ever heard Lewis say on the phone. Yeah, because he's just on the phone like, no, I'd love to fuck your pussy, great. I'm just super tired. <laughs> I'm just sleepy. <laughs> no, I'd love to wear you out, baby. <laughs> I want to fuck you so good with my cock. I want to eat your pussy. No, but I'm. I'm sleepy. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, Cut. you can just hear her on the other end, like, let me come suck that dick. And you're like, <laughs> oh, no, I'd love to, but <laughs> I gotta like get a up. Big, huge booty black I girl show? at a strip club in Detroit, yeah. and I've never seen two personalities just mesh perfectly together. <laughs> <laughs> personalities wise, like Lewis put his hand up to a mirror, like, there you are, my white whale, my black whale. Dude, she fucking, she was terrifying. Yeah. She like yeah. tattoos all over her, her huge ass. Oh, and she was oh, like, look at my man. booty. Just in Lewis's face. And he's Very like, confident. Oh. Yeah, it was crazy. <laughs> yeah, Confidence yeah. was uncharted. Yeah. I've never seen it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But yeah, um, to get it, out of fucking. But no, I think that uh, you'll you get think that's those what dudes that guy's that you'll text them and then they go like, oh, shit, like that. They weirdly like, like do, you think they were, wait, do you think they were gay or do you think they were not gay? I think there's some dudes that aren't gay. I think there's just a lot of weird like beta male dudes who want friends, who want people. Like it's a weird like I'm, I mean, I'm, I wouldn't mind being friends with a gay guy. Yeah, no, no, no. I understand that, but it's. I like, got it's, one. It's Tim. We're it's good. It's weird. <laughs> no. It's uh, it's weird when you go up to. If I went out, if you were straight, yeah, and you went up to a girl after a comedy show, yeah, and you said, "Here's my number. Let's hang out." That's kind of the implication. Well, that, that, is that, that, that means to we're, date. we're gonna date. Well, not that, but that the implication there is like that's. I want to hook up. That's more yeah. than yeah. I think. You know, right. friendships yeah, I mean, it's a to romantic me thing. develop organically. Yeah, it's not like somebody comes up to you and goes, "I'd love to be your friend." Like what? Yeah. Like, but that's what the yeah. kind of the age we're in right now with yeah. social Dude, media. Some people do that sometimes. Like just guys or whatever. They're like, "I hey, wish I hang out." It's like what? Right. Yeah. What right. Are you talking about. But I've right. Done <laughs> <laughs> I've had fans. Right. It's insane. Dude, there's. If we were if we were children, I would light you on fire right now. I've seen people come up to Ari at the stand. And it's very, we like it's familiar you're, you're with famous, like, though. That's know. a little different. As a fan, it's a different. Yeah, fans, like, yeah. fans that want to like yeah. that happens all the time. Oh, People will hang out. I know about you. We, we, we would be right, friends, I'm like yeah. Right. And it has to happen naturally. You're not letting it happen naturally. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Creeping this me is out. not organic. I've had yeah. a guy do a favor for me, like just like, hey, let me get your note. He like helped me do this thing uh, I wanted to buy, and he like had it, and he like listens to. He's heard me on podcast, and then all of a sudden just. Now texts me like we grew up together, and, then and you I'm ignore like, it a bunch of times. I ignored a bunch of times. Just keeps texting me, and finally I'm like, "Yeah, dude, stop." It's creepy. I don't, I don't know you. What did you say? You, you gotta just run said... into somebody a few times, and you slowly you get into a conversation. I mean, that's how any of us became friends, yeah. right? You, you see each other. I remember a bunch. when you were coming out from LA. I'd say hello a couple times, and then just over the time. Yeah, me and Ari, out. we went, me, you, and Dave Smith went to. Uh, you you that, probably met first here. Yeah, I've diner years years on the ago. Upper West Side after Stand Up New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like when you were still barking. Yeah, yeah. Like right when I first started. But that's what it is. That's what all friendships are. It's just yeah, it's, it's, organically. Like you guys want to, it's like yeah, I'm, I'm in town. I'll, I'll come with you guys. Because there's some people. Uh, w what's crazy is when you hang out with a person you don't want to be their friend, and they're like, "Why aren't we hanging out?" You're like, "Cause you I suck. I don't care for you. I don't like yeah. the way your personality works." Yeah, Deepu. I realize that when he's I just reading another <laughs> Reddit thread on eating butt. <laughs> <laughs> <trying to> <laughs> Have you ever had something like you can't tell anybody about? You're like, I can only tell them like my real friends about it. And then you start to go to the phone, and you're like, holy shit, dude, I only have two real friends. <laughs> something deep and <laughs> yeah. dark. Yeah, yeah. Something like What's weird is like when you have like a real friend and you haven't talked to him in a long time, and then you're like, are we not real friends anymore? <laughs> or, uh, I'm sorry, I didn't check in. I didn't, did I not renew my policy? Yeah. I'm just not friends with anybody, really, that's not a comic anymore. Okay. Sometimes yeah, you call either. somebody it's and weird then you go back from high school I, I, and that's I'm, it. I'm friendly. I'm like acquaintance with them. I'll go home from high school and we'll go to a diner or something and we'll hang out a little bit. But it's like, you know, like a friend. What do I fucking you try to get friend? them to subscribe the entire time? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you use the promo code. You, rap, just, you get six you get, off the entire network. You get Legion of Skanks. <laughs> you get part of the problem. <laughs> you, you hey, just do it on iTunes. Build. If you can't yeah. subscribe, help us out on iTunes. Just I mean, they're telling you they have cancer. You're like, listen, yeah. listen, can you Take please your last $6 fucking dollars subscribe? Use it. Guys, um, should we take a break or keep going? Let's push to two. Yeah, uh, we'll just keep going. We're at an hour, four minutes right now. So if you want to take a break. How long do you normally yeah. go? Well, Bobby does six hour. I don't know if you've seen, <laughs> I don't know if you've seen Francis Ford Kelly. But yeah. he, does, uh, <laughs> he does it all. He does 19 hour podcast. You know, there are multiple bottles of water in this studio. I know, but I just want him to drink mine. <laughs> oh, okay. Fun. Nice. I think he's been drinking it. Yeah, got it. All right. Um, How do you eat pussy? Did you answer that? All right. Why did you say it so 
Accusatory. <laughs> I'm so a, I'm a, he says you got shit. Yeah, my I'm reddish a, is good. I'm a start from behind kind of guy. You always go from behind. I like uh, stomachs. No, I like standing up, kissing, turn them around, bend them over, pull down the shorts, and get in there. Get in there. And, and I'll tell you this: you an, start that's an ass eating. Uh, oh, it stance. turns into it. But I'll tell you this: if it's done with the proper timing, ramps the women up very quickly. And also, I like to go around on the front and play with the clit with my thumb on the front as I'm going from behind. Is that a proper technique? Mm-hmm. Yeah! I think that was <laughs> simple as best. Yeah. I got to say, you talked about this one time on a podcast on yeah. Rocky WD, and I yeah. did it with my ex. I, did, I never did ate from behind. And That's she all liked it. it. It's all about that. Yeah. I'll tell you what it is. Sometimes it creeps girls out. Nah, it's good. <laughs> but some girls, I, I've been love. with. <laughs> <laughs> like, nah, you should definitely do more, that more, more. But I've been with, that. I've been with other girls who are like, "What are you doing? What are you doing?" You're like, "I'm not gonna fucking stick my dick in your butt. I'm gonna eat your pussy from behind." I was saying, we, uh, he asked my method, and I said, "I start kissing, then I turn around, bend him over, pull the you pants." You always down. start from behind. Always start from behind. Really? And then I, what I'll do is, if I flip over, and that if it's a treat, if, if I flip what if, over, what if you've been out all day? I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Put down my mouth there. That's get a job why done. your nose is like that. It's flattened yeah. against their asshole. I'll tell you this. I was built to eat pussy from behind. God was like, I'll give him the face like a Roman helmet in order for him to do battle. Whistle battle from behind. I'm like a, like how rams yeah, are dude. built to fucking if slam my their nose head. was smashed down into my upper lip and I this. couldn't smell anything either, I would By also the way, do no that. no smell and I can breathe the whole time. <laughs> That's weird. I'm like Aquaman <laughs> of eating pussy. <laughs> I can talk to fish. Yeah, Lewis has to come up. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. My arm's asleep. I'm back. Yeah, I get in. I, um, so that's my method. Cool. Good yeah, stuff. right to the point. Direct. To yeah. the point. What about you, Ari? I'll, uh, I'll start with a, with a nice dinner. Uh, maybe, uh, <laughs> oh, thank you. An appetizer. Yeah. Filipino or something, you know, something exotic. Well, no, he eats in front of her. Yeah, and he goes like this. He's like, I yeah. want to get my breath right. I want to get some garlic so your puss stings. Maybe, maybe before dinner, we just like immediately fuck you by the door. So with a condom. So like, just so you know, this is going to happen. Don't yeah. be worried about it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go get something nice. Yeah. Let me come home. That'd be great if you could just get a, like a grudge fuck right yeah. out of the Dude, way. But wait, isn't that? I think. Don't why work, don't, don't you just don't fuck, just like first, fuck, and then like then let's go do, eat? Because you'll actually have a good time. Yeah. Oh yeah, and you'll find out a lot about the person. That happened Sex one time. I got a rub and tug once, okay. and the girl jerked me off before the massage, and I was like, wow. Wouldn't a ma- what a dessert much, first? What a much better <laughs> technique. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dessert yeah, first. No, you're not worried the whole time. You're, you're like, not thinking you can fully about enjoy it. Like, yeah, you want to enjoy the massage. You don't yeah, want to have a dude, boner. Coming we- quick, you're like, hey. But so- most guys like to get blown. Yeah. First, isn't that like more? Well, yeah, but we're talking about before the, the no, whole date. Usually yeah. they massage you for a while, yeah, and yeah, then it's yeah. like, oh, are you just gonna happen? Yeah, you, know, you got a boner. Like you're like you're lying on your stomach with a boner, and it hurts. And you're like, ah, oh, just fucking flip me over and jerk me off. But now you focus on how great the massage is, and that's almost an analogy for your date yeah. scenario. Oh, Lewis only doesn't get the blowjob because it costs extra. He's got a child right, to feed him. Right, right, right. yeah, 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 yeah. So sense. he's got to yeah, he's saving. He tells James. Sometimes I kill two birds with one stone and just feed him. Yeah. Oh. So then we come Yikes. home. Then That's we come true. home, and I so say, "So you grudge uh, fuck first, then have a nice dinner." <laughs> yeah, just like let's get this out of the way. Then we have a nice dinner. When we come home, I go, uh, "You know, get comfortable. I'm gonna run the bath for you." Oh. And then, uh, oh. You know, wipe you down a little well, bit. Well, they're then. Jews. There's like a weird thing, like a, a mold or a film on their body. So yeah. And then as you're getting comfortable in the bath, really enjoying it, and I'm, I'm rubbing you down. You drop a toaster in. Then I grab <laughs> you by your hair, <laughs> grab you by your hair, and violently yank you out of the tub. <laughs> just stop. Just, just kicking, kicking onto the, just onto wet the, feet, yeah. kicking yeah. on a linoleum floor. What are you doing, <laughs> Dragging yeah. her across the floor. Ah, uh, fat grabbing his wrist to stop the pain. What are you doing ah. as you hear a, feel a slap across the face? Don't ask questions. <laughs> I'm in control. Yeah. She goes, I was in that bath. It was so warm. <laughs> yeah. This is very similar to mine. By the yeah. way. This is pretty. Knees yeah. over your head. I, uh, I get in there, and uh, I feel what you're into. I go, clit. Stop, Paul, Ari, stop, Get all sorts of stop, stuff please, until I feel what you're going for. Please, please. My mom is going to miss me. <laughs> my mom is going to miss me. I have a nephew. That's once I'm satisfied, you feel like uh, it's my game and you're playing it. Uh, She's looking I out the window imagine, the whole time. <laughs> I just imagine Ari goes, how's the bath? He like ducks down. Or he's <laughs> bath. He goes, how's that bath? And then he goes, you're in my world now. <laughs> and I just go, ah! <laughs> Then I take fingers and I put them inside your puss okay. uh, as my fi- as my tongue is on your clit. I go back and forth like that. I'll grab grab one boob pretty hard, back and forth, <laughs> see the the whole boob. Then just tick 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 on the nipple. Yeah. Uh-huh. And then when you're like that hurts, like then I choke you hard. Oh. <laughs> then they I'm go, like, oh, enough ah! talking. Ah! 
I want to feel your uh, your hand. Try to pry my my hand right. off your neck, <laughs> and uh, you don't get it off. Right this away. sounds like it's working for Lauren. <laughs> this could be a Jersey thing. You don't get it off right away, and then I uh, stick my tongue into your deep as deep as I can. I got a long tongue into your hole. Into okay. a pussy. Yeah. You go all the way you in. You go all the way in. Yeah. So you yeah. fuck her with your tongue. Yeah. Do you have and then I'll take my the take my thumb on the on the uh, on the clit. I'll yeah. go back and forth. Tongue in the clit, hand inside. That's a great that's back a hand forth. inside. Finger on the clit. That's uh, a classic on the one clit. two one. Finger inside. Do yeah. you do the uh the No, I'll like, go one finger to first. I'll I'll, 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 I'll wait till you want more and then I'll go two and get Ooh. deep in there. And you do the come here, obviously. Yeah, Everyone knows the come here. Then you do you spread your fingers once they're inside? Once in a while. Once in a while. You try to mix it up. Yeah. Try to mix it up. You want to hear what she's into, you know? That's what you want to like get it get you listening to the ground like an old Native American? Yeah, get a taster plate, and then you're like, whatever you like the best of that. There'll yeah. be more of that. But still, you don't get 100% of anything. Oh. You go back and forth. I like your real-world pussy-eating technique. Yeah. I'm and keeping then we, it real. Then we go to the bed. Then the bed. Yeah. So what, this was so just, just the, yeah. the wet the linoleum floor, the floor after you've yanked her? Yeah. After you, she's on your fucking carpet <laughs> after you've yanked her wet body out of the bath. <laughs> it's made that soft thud. <laughs> Ow, my hip. Ow. Ari, seriously, my hip. He's trying to drag her and she's not into it anymore. <laughs> seriously, you hurt my hip when you drag me out of the I'm not into this. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, I think sex first dates need to start being commonplace. This yeah, gay, well, gay dudes is always out of the way. Get it out of the way. There yeah. would be no then. such thing. Uh, gay oh, dudes yeah. is going. I mean, that's Third the one date. thing about that. Make There's you no wait way. for it. That yeah. really is a cruel thing. Yeah. Where they're like, oh man, I've had yeah. Because then once you know you're gonna fuck, I just went out with a girl who we ha- we kind of lost touch. I I left town for the for the winter, and then I went out of town for. We just lost touch after like last November. So I think she had a boyfriend in the interim. <laughs> and we went out, but we'd already fucked up a bunch of times. And then this time we just went out, didn't make out, didn't do anything, just went out, a nice date, but we both knew what was going to happen. Yeah. yeah. So it was like, it was a nice date. We just kind of built to it. Mm-hmm. It's like someone we got back, it was on. Yeah. The build up. Yeah. The build up. Yeah. Build up mm-hmm. is crucial. The build up is okay, though, crucial. if you know where it's going to go. Yeah. If you're left like, ah, is this going to even happen? Then it's a lot more frustrating. Yeah. yeah. I, here's my thing. What I'll do, I mean, I'm, I'm not saying on that, but when I was single, like, I would always be trying to, like, work on, like, three different sets of pussy at the same time. Sets of pussy. Well, which I would, is multiple no, pussies. No, no, no. no. I mean, like, I, was, I, I would be trying to, like, let's say I'm at a show and there's, like, two different girls I'm trying to fuck. I would literally, up until the last moment, I would still try to play both of them at the whole time. Like, like Bill Bellamy and How to Be a Player. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's a problem with Tinder. You go to the bathroom. They're fucking quickly swiping, trying to hook up some other day. Yeah. Like, lost in this, lady. Yeah. That's great. Really? Oh, yeah. And dudes do it, too. Yeah. No one's fucking really yeah, enjoying it. Like, hmm, I wonder Bumble. Can't wait till they get back. Are you on Bumble? Yeah. Bumble's great. Bumble's the best. Are you on Bumble? Yeah. I love Are Mark, all these I love Mark Norman's version of Bumble because he's like, he, he's like, oh, it's the girl reach out first. He goes, yeah, now you come up with something witty, you fucking dick. Yeah, that's yeah. great. You come up with something. And they never, they, they, they stink. He goes, he goes, all they do is go, how was your week? Fuck you. Work harder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You all say that. Yeah. I've, 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 I've said to a girl, like, I'm like, that's what you're opening with? Or they're like, hi. Just uh, 18 or sometimes What's your, put it on you? you open with Bumble? Or sometimes they go, oh, oh tell me something funny. It's like, no, bitch, you tell me something funny. Oh, yeah. I would make me furious. If the guy's hot enough, I'll just ask him out, which it only happened once. That, and you I'll be like, 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 let's go. Let's go. We'll be uncomfortable together. Instead yeah, of yeah. Over, like, oh, totally. Was he like, yeah, absolutely, yeah, uh-huh. yeah, of course. Gave me his number like immediately, and then we went out that night. That's that's what you do. We're both saying, hey, we're both attracted to each yeah, other. Yeah, you're adults. Yeah, I that's said I'm supposed to be. Last night, gay men have better. Out. Last night, I, I was talking to a girl on Bumble within. 10 minutes of conversation I just set up a date for Sunday I was like I'm not gonna keep doing this and I went like this I turned around I looked at my dad I go boom put it on the calendar (laughs) that's how you do it dad (laughs) dad put a gold star on the calendar pass the chopped liver but when you go on those dates like you have to you basically like Fuck the well, first time. Okay. Really? As long, yeah. Right. As long as it's not like, as long as it's not like you're an asshole, I don't like you at all. Right. Wait, don't you do this? But you go with the idea that, that we're gonna fuck. You right. can only talk yourself out of this. Let's just get comfortable. Right. So, number got shot. You guys went out. Number banged, and then mm-hmm. that's a fucking wow. But you would yeah. kill it. Yeah, you would kill it on Bumble nah, because all you gotta do is put a picture of you on Comedy Central York. or something like that. A little bit of a talk. What's that? Nothing. We'll clean the audio. CIA. Um, I'm amazed by that. You yeah, would do great though. Just put a picture of you in Comedy Central. You just can't. Say, you just it. can't say. Oh, a lot of guys put their picture with Conan as their Tinder picture. Uh, yeah. Like, oh yeah. Oh, it's <laughs> all comedians. I won't yeah. say who, but a is lot, a lot a of comedians. Lot of you guys are on there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on. Yeah. Yeah, I saw you. What's up? You didn't swipe right, you whore. No. Oh, how heartbreaking is that? Lewis? I used to swipe when I saw. You're not even on. You have an early on. Tinder. I would swipe just to be like, haha, you're out here too, right? But with a little bit of thought in your head of like, that's the best. Where you go like, yeah, you get like a like, you're like, huh? What are you? And then they don't like back. You're like. You I think girls just don't want to Lauren give me true or false. Girls don't want you just be like, uh, all right, fine, we're both into it. Let's fuck. 
It's like, oh, let's just go on a fucking one drink, idiot. Yeah, one it's or two one drink. Yeah, and just go have one drink. Oh, smell the smell like, the, the guy's pheromones. A creep. Yeah. Also, I, I don't want a girl. I'm nervous if a girl comes over, not for like getting robbed, but I'm like, let's just fucking know each other a, a, a yeah. minute, yeah. right? An hour right, right, right. of talking. Yeah. And then yeah, you have to hang out a little bit, not just be like, well, why? Unless you have already fucked, and then you're like, why don't you come over? Yeah, I mean, look. By the way, there's a there's that's a thing in itself. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I've met girls at a bar. And we've been like talking for a minute, and I, I'm like, hey, let's go fuck in the bathroom right now, and they've done it, right? But that's like that's wow, a, that's what? a thrill. What, what bar? Yeah, can Is you it go, the bar can from you Roadhouse? Rewind? Stand up, New York. <laughs> just rewind New York there. Thing. I mean, all right. So uh, this, I've been watching you have your drink that you paid for. <laughs> what do you think we have a rendezvous yeah. in the bathroom? And they're yeah. down with it. Yeah, I've had that a handful of times. I wish Bob. It's one there. of them now. Tone on. What motivational ringtone do you have? <laughs> Did Stan Soder, my friend. That's a good song. I write lyrics to my uh, ringtone. Mm. And it's usually... Uh, what? Beat it. What are you doing? On there. Was it business or pleasure? It was business. Date nerd, date Ooh. scientist. It's always business. I only have two friends. Are you on Bumble? I am, but I'm more old school. I like to find people in person. You're more old school on Bumble? <laughs> 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 I'm old school on Bumble. I'm on it, but I find people in yeah, person. I'm, I'm mid-2016 <laughs> yeah. on Bumble. Uh, Deepu picked up a chick at my, sh at my show last week. Yeah, I'm seeing her now. Killed wow, it. really? Yeah. She was in the I bathroom. I was very shocked. Yeah. Dude, I don't know he just put a black bag over her and picked her up over her shoulder. I have no idea how to pick up a girl that is not a fan already. Yeah. Really? I, I, it's just like I don't feel comfortable. For too long, I'm like, I, I don't. What am I gonna say? Hi. He's got to recognize the sign. I don't feel comfortable. Yeah. Recognize the face. buying sign. It's when you're in sales, people will give you buying signs, right? It, so they'll least, say something. At least they have to have seen you on stage. Mm -hmm. Something. Um, no. I prefer if they have it. I would just go up to a girl like a fucking orthodontist and be yeah. like, uh, we should go. Oh, yeah. I, I think I'd much rather do that if I just saw a girl in public and like, hey, would you like to? No, it makes it easier. Girl? Look, when you're on stage, you've already you've already broken the ice. They they already have a piece of you. Yeah. They look up to you. They're putting you on a pedestal in a weird way because what we're doing in real life is we're putting women on a pedestal constantly. Yeah. Put the pussy on the pedestal, right? Yeah. So that's what we do. So we get to flip the script for a minute, and it does weirdly like break the ice Grab and it make by it the easier. Pussy for, yeah. for the yeah. metaphor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's where he got it from. That's where he understood. No, he didn't actually mean grab a woman's vagina. I think he meant like grab. I don't think he meant that. No, I think he. I, I think don't he, care what he I meant. I think it's a it's a statement that means, you know, gr you go know, for it hard. Go, go for it and, and and lead in in a sexual way. Yeah. You know, get this their isn't attention. This is a fucking Emerson quote. Yeah. It's fucking Trump said grab them by the pussy. He didn't. No, he didn't he mean he that, Dan. Literally. I mean, no, he, he meant there was a subtext to it. I he, didn't, he wasn't advocating people going to salt women. Yeah, no, but when you're home, we say you grab it, you grab it by the balls. It's the same thing. Yeah, you take life by the that, balls. That's not take life by the balls. That's a brilliant you're, point, you're Lewis. Piggybacking really? No, it's piggybacking a brilliant point. That's correct. It's an absolute brilliant point. Stop pissing up to your boss. He makes brilliant points often. I'm all for hating Trump, but that guy did not mean that literally. I'm an idiot savant. Thank you, Tim. Nobody, nobody thinks he meant that literally. And you don't I don't think, think he meant. I think he you meant don't like. Think it, but you're just. I think he meant like put his hand on a woman's pussy. Stop no, it, Dan. No, no, you no, really he, don't believe he, that. He said kiss you and know. grab them. How? Why am I an idiot for thinking he meant he that literally? Be, when your first two sentences before that were he kisses. Hold he's on, like, if, if you kiss them, you grab them. Then you grab them by the pussy. I'm nuts for thinking that he meant that literally. Dan. Uh, do you, <laughs> if you took one hour of any of our conversation yeah. in life privately, we would s we say Lewis. so much worse <laughs> shit than, than, than what yeah, I'm saying in your camp. <laughs> you're trying I'm, to act like an hour of my footage is as way, damaging I as yours. I don't like Trump, but you I, could be put on cr for war crimes yeah. if they did an hour of your fucking conversation. Yeah, uh, there's so many liberal brigade. dudes like men don't talk that way. It's like, shut are you crazy? Up, it was it was it was fucking of course, mild. Yeah, yeah. it was mild. men do talk like that. I'm not saying that. Me and Rob Mayu, hold on. Me and Rob Mayu, we went on Shiprock last year. Remember, we closed the door and we took out all the alcohol. We snuck onto the boat. <laughs> and we started jumping up and down, screaming the word rape. <laughs> 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 and Rob Mayer's on Facebook going, I can't believe Trump would say something like that. Yeah. I'm like, Mayer, we had a rape chant on yeah. the fucking boat. Don't you remember <laughs> the rape chant of the high seas? <laughs> yeah, he wasn't giving a seminar on what yeah, you're supposed to do. Listen, but I'm, I'm just he's saying... a crude guy. It was a vulgar remark. But yeah. I, I think people are saying 
that he was advocating sexual assault. I think that's a jump. That's a leap. That's a, that's that a is a jump. Yeah, yeah. That it's is a jump. Based on your My jump. I wasn't saying he was advocating sexual assault. I was saying he. I think he literally meant like sometimes you can grab women, mm. just like grab them by the pussy. No, I think up. he was t- talking figuratively. figuratively. I think he was like he was like yeah, do you grab her by the pussy? You let her know what's up. You let her know who the fucking man. Grab is a bull by the horns. <laughs> yeah, that's my way of saying. That's really it. Okay, that's your new way of saying. Yeah. it. I, I mean, look, it's just it's just all stupid. He, I'm ready this, to allow. This, this is just such a stupid little thing. We're acting like this is the end of his. If this is the oh, thing that geez. puts anybody over the edge, they're a fucking moron. Yeah. Okay. Like this is just uh, you know he's a fu- he's a uh, you, you said best he's a crude guy right. he's not presidential that's right. I think a problem I think you need to fucking yeah if you say that like I don't want my president talking like regular dudes talk yeah it reminds right. me of I like my I like, like okay, my presidents of- raping people in private Behind sending the scenes, yeah. sending private investigators to their rape victims. And destroying their lives privately. What a balls out move that Trump brought the six the six uh, gra- women who accused Clinton of raping them. Gangster. Tim, that Tim was Dillon a great move. Tim, Tim, Dillon the, yeah. Tim Dillon had the greatest Facebook wow. post about well, I that. I said, if you don't think that's funny, nothing's funny. It's great. Yeah. I love how, yeah. I love how yeah. Hillary Clinton true. now is going, is going uh, you know, uh, Russia's trying to get involved in our elections. It's like, Hillary, that's what you did as Secretary of State yeah. in yeah. other countries. To yeah. every country. Yeah. Yeah. Everything yeah. south of Mexico. all you do. Elections. Is try to get involved in their elections. It's like but those guys I, are yeah. like, I think you're cheating on me. It's like, because you're cheating? Is that I love how <laughs> what's, what's amazing in that debate is like he, he basically says, listen, your husband's a rapist. And like there's no human emotion in her that wants that, that says, no, 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 my husband's not a rapist. She just he has that quote you know, from Obama where she's like, well, when you go low, we go high. And it's yeah. like, what would have merited a response? Like if, yeah. if, if Trump was like, your husband's a murderer. She's like, ma'am, you go low, we go high. Like your husband's a genocidal maniac. Well, you go low, we go high. Like, and wait, what do you mean? We, you go, you go low, we go high. You just went low. You went low. Went low back. You go. I thought. Yeah, oh, we're gonna go low. Huh? Trump's response to it, which you know, he was like, "Look, I apologize." He was like, "But there's real shit happening." I mean, the, in the dude world. helped cover up a rape. That that's debate. a fucking. That's a he great. He won that debate. I don't. Oh, he killed it. I wouldn't say smashed it. I'd say he won sixty forty. He did well. He did. I'd even go fifty-five forty-five. Yeah, I look at a good set. He, especially <laughs> when they were talking about taxes and they were talking about all the finance stuff, he sounded like like she was literally just repeating these very basic talking points. That Let's get America working years. again. Your husband's a rapist. Let's get America <laughs> back to work. Like, what the fuck? Are you even in the moment of what's happening right now? The hardest these I These four women who you destroyed are staring at you. The, uh, there was two great memes. One was, <laughs> the Bill, was Bill Clinton's with the googly eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And They're then staring one. at you and she's like reciting these tropes. She's like, if we work together, what? What the fuck? We are being led in this country by sociopaths and crazy people. But that's who gets into politics. That's who gets yeah, in. That's who. And why are we? That's like when. That's like when NFL uh, players beat their wives and were like, right. "How could he? Yeah, yeah, they yeah. hit people for a living yeah. to yeah, give do. another man yeah. brain damage." It shows. And, now you, and now his and wife high fives because somebody's fucking <laughs> a vegetable now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah. his wife, gotta, his wife, who by the way is fucking him primarily. They're gone. The money. They're gone. Yeah, they so don't tell me their wives. Maybe a few of them are in love, but most of them are like, "I got my house. I got." my car mm-hmm. sometimes he wakes up in the middle of the night and picks up a dresser and throws it at me <laughs> <laughs> kind of the game you gotta, you gotta take but it's a nice dresser it's, a, it's yeah, an oak dresser, dresser and yeah. he's been doing his deadlifts because <laughs> he gets that up so i've seen in terminator 2 where they're just putting each other through the drywall yeah. <laughs> but that's what it is it's like that's what be you're like gotta be be a t1000 to t his t800 <laughs> bitch slap rap it in yeah. your cocaine tongue yeah. <laughs> yeah. just chasing her in a big ring yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's on a dirt bike with her three kids yeah. that's <laughs> she lifts her kid off a dirt bike. Daddy just got cut by the Titans. <laughs> <laughs> you can be my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same fucking thing. It's the same thing. All politicians are scumbag murderers. Yeah, it's and true. all NFL true. players are fucking barbarians. Ah, oh, fuck. That was a fun episode. Yeah, no. Are we done? Yeah. Right, the one, fuck up, Deepu. 123. That's nothing. That's early. You know what I did when I fucking hosted? You went like two hours, right? No, over two hours. Like two and a half. And cool. Stole, Guess what? You stole a lot he has of a stuff. Career. Everyone listening results. right now is going to want more of this podcast, and that's why we're going to stop. No, they right wanted now. more last time. They yeah. did? There was like, yeah. I mean... You weren't even here, Scope. Yes, uh, I was. You weren't even. Oh, you shut up. Why are you wearing. Uh, that's like 80s gym sweatshirt. Exactly. Like Hans and Franz shit. Are you bigger? Have you been working out? Yeah. You getting no, decent? No. I looks... haven't really been working out at all. Hey, I think I'm getting getting fat, ball, I'm just, a Scope. I'm a pomp. You are. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah Hans and like Franz that. sweatshirt. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Scopo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's do plugs. RobertKellyLive.com to see where Bobby's going to be. And Oh, you actually have the dates. I forgot you guys do that. Yep. We'll get to. Uh, we'll. Let's do Bobby Live. It's his podcast. 
Uh, I will be, when does this come out, next Monday? Sunday. This, this Sunday. This Sunday, I am going to be in Long Island with Tim Dillon. We're oh, going to be at McGuire's Friday. Classic. I don't think we are. Are we? Brokerage, are we? I thought, I thought brokerage. No, oh, we are. Oh, that's going to be Yeah, fun. we're doing McGuire's on. I think you're at the brokerage, though. <laughs> <laughs> Tim Dillon I and I. I forget about those sometimes. Yeah, we're we're going to be at McGuire's on Friday. Ooh. Then two shows at Governor's in Levittown on Saturday. Yeah, baby. Uh, danceorder.com for tickets. You can follow me at Dan Soder and listen to The Bonfire Mondays and Wednesdays, 6 to 8 p.m. on Sirius Satellite Radio. Ari Shafir, what do you got? As someone who grew up not around here, Levittown sounds like a made-up Long Island name. <laughs> Dude, it is, yeah. it is. Where were you? Uh, Lev- Levittown? It is like a nightmare over there. Yeah. All right, uh, where are you going to be? Well, the important thing is to know is that my, uh, my, new, my TV show is back. Yeah! Thursday nights at midnight Eastern, uh, 11 o'clock Central, and, you know, the rest. Um... I guess we've already done one week. You can see it on the Comedy Central app, or you can see it on Comedy Central television every Thursday night after at midnight. Uh, Watch tune it. Tune in. We got a lot of great comics, and um, this Brian is... Regan's doing it this year. Got a lot of returning ones. Big J. I watched the preview, man. It looks fucking awesome. Yeah. It looks awesome. Julian McCullough's on Julian there telling McCullough, a great story. I mean, there's baskets. a lot of great people. Aaron Berg. Berg. There's yeah. uh, Joe List. Joe List. Classic uh, uh, You Know What Dude. So check that Survivor. out. This is not happening. Um, yeah, what's the guy? From, I can't remember from Baskets. What's his name? I can't Louis Anderson. Name. Louis Anderson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then uh, I'll be October 18th in New York, in Brooklyn. I'm doing the Bell House. And then yeah. I'm taping my special in Austin, Texas, November 2nd through the 5th. If you're anywhere around Austin, Cap tickets. City. Cap City. Get Fuck tickets yeah. at AriTheGreat.com. And that's it. Lewis, what do you got? Uh, <clears throat> got, a, got a bunch of stuff. I got a. Uh, Go to GomezComedy.com. I know that I'm in Rhode Island, Providence, Comedy Connection in December. I think I got a gig in Long Island in November. GomezComedy.com. Gomez Comedy on Instagram. Check out the countdown every Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time with myself and Michael Bisping, the UFC middleweight champion who just successfully defended his title. This yeah. Time. What a good fight that was. Ooh, yeah. scary, dude. It's so scary to watch. What a great way to let the guy who put, beat him send him out. It's like, all right, we had a war. Yeah, yeah especially yeah. with that extra punch at the end. And yeah, then that yeah. war, a five-round war. Fucking great. Uh, so also check out, obviously, on the Gas Digital Network, Legion of Skanks podcast, Wednesdays at 9 p.m. Eastern. Real Ass podcast every Wednesday at 12 noon Eastern. And uh, also the Roastmasters. Now we do it every other week at the stand. I host it. Tournament's going on right now. Tournament's going Who on. You got? Who's your pick? You can't, I think you can't say. finals, in my opinion, is going to be Zach versus Evan Williams. That's what you think? Yeah, Evan I picked Evan, but then I'm like, oh, why am I overlooking Zach? Of course, Zach. Zach's favorite, a monster. But nobody wants to pick Zach because it's the obvious choice. Well, Zach is. He's also taking it very, very, very seriously. Some he's of those funny jokes that he told. Yeah. Dude, he Karen goes off into this time. weird world where he's almost like, like. Like it's it. like, you know what it's like? It's like when Frank the, t- the Tank debates in old school. Oh, yeah. he's like, <laughs> he blacks out. Similar studies have shown that the conversation <laughs> can't be happening. Like, oh, well, I'm sorry, what happened? Black out. That's yeah. how you debate. Yeah, it was. it's a lot of fun. And we actually we, ha- we have the live stream on Gas Digital Network. So to GasDigitalNetwork.com, you guys can watch it live every other Tuesday. The next one will be on the 18th. Ron Bennington and Robert Kelly will both Ooh. be judging on that one. Ooh. So. Ooh. Tim Dillon, what do you got? All right, if you like debates and you like comedy at the stand, uh, the, our podcast, Tim Dillon's going to hell, me and Ray Cup are coming to the stand on Wednesday, October 19th. We're going to show the presidential debate, the final debate. Trump has nothing to lose. I thought he's down in all the polls. Yeah. Uh, what did you think? So he's going to say. Something. Something. I thought J- J- uh, Dave Smith was doing the debates. There. He, he just did, did the last one. Oh, he okay. did the last okay. one. Okay. Trump has nothing to lose. So I hope he goes into like who killed Kennedy and just yeah. crazy stuff. I, I hope he gets I'm going to tell you everything. Like, what are you aliens planning? are I mean, real. Here's the deal. He's coming into that debate with nothing to lose. Now imagine a guy like Trump with nothing to lose. Yeah. That's going to be fascinating. I hope he goes and says, what are your plans on Syria? Please tell us your exact she plans. She won't even have to. The American people are so dumb. All she really has to say is, we're going to get everyone back. To, we're going to work together yeah. in Syria. It's, we'll work it's so together. funny. Dude. It's like you're talking it, to a four-year-old. It's, mm-hmm. My uncle had a great quote. because the people are too dumb to be governed. Like, they can't yeah, yeah. even that be governed. That is true. It's, it's, uh, I uh, am an idiot. You want to see a real nightmare? October 28th, I'm at uh, Columbia University. That's going to be a real shock for both of us. Um, uh, and uh, GasDigital.com Tim Dillon's going to hell Podcast on iTunes Rate, subscribe Thank you Chris Scopo uh, This Saturday I'll be at Gotham Comedy Club Go check that out And I'll be on Red Eye tomorrow night Hey! hey! Chris Scopo they grows up TV debut. They yeah. grows up They grows up And they grows up Thumbs <laughs> up Congratulations If you guys dude. like Scopo's Non-existent commentary On the Wait till he's Steamrolled by no A I'm gonna talk about it. tomorrow Scopo Tim's said, coming over To write jokes Watch a lot of Blinking and head movement <laughs> Scopo said nothing About the debates When we talked about it Just now You'll get into it dude Hey get comfortable Go I'm in there And push Trump. him around I don't know I don't give a fuck You don't give a fuck Lord. I just I love to see it 
Lauren. What's up? What do you have? Just at Lauren Kubera, and uh, I'm going to read Bobby's dates. Mm. Tomorrow, he's He's doing a sexy voice? Mm, no. Um, <laughs> he's going to be at a high It's like you ever almost break up with a girlfriend, but it's over, but it hasn't been officially over? <laughs> <laughs> and you're trying to make a joke, like, yeah, it was funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Were you Christ. trying to make a joke about the relationship? <laughs> where you're like, yeah, it's not like I'm going to miss your mom, right? She's like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I love you. Want to get something to eat? No. Yeah. Uh... 13th, he's going to be at Side Splitters in Tampa, 14th and 15th as well. Um, and then just go to robertkellylive.com for the rest of his dates. There it is. Depot, what do you got? Uh, at R2 Depot. I'm very good pussy <laughs> technique. You know, right. I'm going to take all these tips from I got from you guys. I appreciate that. I'm gonna, he's going to transcribe them down <laughs> and then go through it and post it to the Reddit. I'll play the live stream for her of this episode. Like, Maybe I'm going to try yeah. all these. I'm going to do an audio cue. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it. All right. Cool. Great. Well, this was, uh, you know what, dude, without the dude, the disciple of dudes. Thanks for watching, listening. Subscribe, rate, and uh, do all that stuff. Right? Is that yep. what he says? Bobby's eating his third lunch right now. <laughs> he's, he's like a <laughs> hobbit. All right.